Welcome to the Fantasy Audiobook. Doomsday Game. Opening Awakening SSS Level Anti-Armor. Chapter 1. Green Castle City, Novice Village Number. 401. Zhao Yuan stood there blankly, the surrounding scenery made him feel extremely strange, some figures in gorgeous armor stood standing among the street shops. How is this going? Costume film shooting base. Didn't I just fall asleep at home? Why did you appear here as soon as you opened your eyes? A large number of memory fragments poured into Zhao Yuan's mind continuously, making him fall into a brief daze. Zhao Yuan, what's wrong with you? You should be semi-digitized at the age of 18, haven't you chosen your cornerstone skills yet? A boy with handsome hair and a flat head asked doubtfully. Zhao Yuan blinked, a lot of information bloomed in his mind. This is a parallel world similar to Blue Star, but thousands of years ago, the Doomsday Game came suddenly. The entire planet is semi-digitized, and the human metropolis is divided into safe zones by the Doomsday Game system. In the area outside, countless ferocious beasts wandered, and human beings became players under the Doomsday Game. Everyone in this world will get their own Doomsday Game system panel at the age of 18. You can choose a cornerstone skill every 10 levels, and you can get a small skill every 5 levels. Players can develop freely and become professionals with different styles. Zhao Yuan absorbed these memories, and realized that the boy with a flat head in front of him was called Zhang Wen, and he was a classmate in elementary school with him. Later, he met again in university, became a classmate, and became a bosom friend as it should be. It's okay, have you obtained the semi-digitalization of the Doomsday Game system? Zhao Yuan quickly adapted to this identity. Well, the selection of cornerstone skills has already begun. Every choice of cornerstone skills is very important, and it is related to the direction of subsequent development. Zhang Wen looked at the three cornerstone options in front of him and fell into thought. 7. Zhao Yuan's body has also been semi-digitized, and a system panel appears in front of his eyes, which he can only see. Name. Zhao Yuan. Level. LV0. Talent. Eternal Blessing. Unique. All skills will remain at SSS level. Hundreds of millions of proficiency unique, the skill will cancel the level cap and can be upgraded without limit. Killing the target will continuously accumulate the proficiency acquisition multiple, current proficiency multiple, 1.5 times. Cornerstone skills, to be selected. Skills, none. Backpack, no. The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. What happened? Two unique talents. According to the memory of this body, there is no talent column in the novice player attribute panel. Could it be? Zhao Yuan was ecstatic in his heart, could this be the golden finger that he traveled through? All skills will remain at SSS level. The skill quality of the Doomsday game is divided into SSS, SS, S, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. The SSS level is the highest quality. It is conceivable how perverted this, eternal blessing, talent is. Hundreds of billions of proficiency, allows the player's skills to have no upper limit level, can be strengthened endlessly, and can continuously increase the multiple of proficiency acquisition. This is simply cheating. Is it too unreasonable? Zhao Yuan held back his excitement and clicked on his cornerstone skill option panel. Three cornerstone options appeared in front of Zhao Yuan, choose one of the three, one is bow and arrow proficient, one is bloodthirsty, and one is anti-armor. Bow and arrow mastery. Become an archer's prerequisite cornerstone ability, please choose carefully. Bloodthirsty. Attacks with blood-sucking attributes. Anti-armor. Take damage and reflect part of the damage to the opponent. Zhao Yuan recalled the knowledge of the original owner, first of all, anti-armor had to be excluded, because this cornerstone skill belongs to the mid-term ability. If there is no strong defense and blood volume, the reflected damage of anti-armor alone will be useless, and you will not know how to die. Bloodthirsty is a very rare option. In the future, you can embark on the road of blood sucking, and the future is limitless. Proficient in bows and arrows, if you are sure that you want to go in the direction of an archer, you will choose. Zhao Yuan thought for a moment and chose, anti-armor. Because Zhao Yuan has the only talent of, eternal blessing, it is a certainty that he will become a powerful player in the future. Zhao Yuan can choose the route that suits him according to his own preferences, without worrying about the strength of his skills. System. Player Zhao Yuan has selected the cornerstone ability, anti-armor. 
the player obtains the D-level anti-armor ability. Affected by Eternal Blessing, anti-armor was promoted to SSS level. Anti-armor LV1 SSS level passively provides high physical defense and magic defense. When receiving damage, it reflects real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacker. This is also too strong. It is indeed the cornerstone ability of SSS level. LV1 provides a high amount of physical and magic defense, and can reflect true damage according to the attacker's strength attribute. The true damage can ignore the damage reduction effect in the enemy's defense, Zhao Yuan has become a real, hedgehog, at this time. Zhang Wen asked, what are the abilities of the three cornerstones you extracted? Minor power enhancement, magic power enhancement, and crit enhancement. I'm more inclined to the direction of the caster, so choosing magic power is the best. Zhao Yuan responded, My options are Bloodthirsty, Bow and Arrow Mastery, and Anti-Armor. Definitely choose Bloodthirsty. This is a rare cornerstone ability. For Anti-Armor, you need to use your body as a meat shield. Without basic attributes as a premise, such a little anti-injury effect is better than nothing. Zhao Yuan interrupted the conversation, Just confirm your choice and see what level it is, and we can start upgrading. Zhang Wen confirmed that he had chosen, Magic Power Enhancement, and obtained S rank Magic Power Enhancement. My god, S class. Zhang Wen's eyes almost popped out, I didn't expect that I would also be blessed by luck one day, and it will be my turn to take you off in the future. S level Magic Power Enhancement. Quickly send the data map to show me. Zhao Yuan responded. Magic Power Enhancement LV1 S level greatly enhances basic magic related attributes and increases magic damage by 10%. Only at level 1, it has 10% magic damage stacking. When the ability level of this cornerstone is increased, it will be very scary. In the future, we estimate that we will become arcanists and bloodthirsty swordsmen. Let's go and get the novice quest. Zhang Wen said with high spirits. I chose anti A, don't worry. Zhao Yuan said to Zhang Wen's unbelievable face, I am a SSS level anti A. Impossible. There are not many SSSS levels in the entire Sha Kingdom. Your expression, is it really a SSSS level anti-armor? Zhang Wen knew the character of his good brother, so he wouldn't joke about this kind of thing. Then, Zhao Yuan sent the attribute map of the SSS level anti-armor. Invincible, invincible, you are about to take off. I thought I was lucky enough, but I didn't expect you to be the most tricky one. Zhang Wen glanced back and forth at the attribute map of the SSS level anti-armor, his eyes lit up. It seems that you are going to take the route of shield defense. Just in time, you resist the monster's damage, and I will release magic crazily from behind. Zhang Wen has already begun to fantasize about the future battle scene. An SSS level plus an S level, even if you encounter elite monsters, you can easily kill them. Zhao Yuan and Zhao Yuan walked through the novice village until they came to the blacksmith. The NPCs in the Doomsday game have high intelligence and self-awareness, but the camp and the player are on one side. The novice's task is usually to find a blacksmith. This is the strategy obtained by the senior professionals after constantly summarizing the rules and benefits. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen formed a team, and teammates were protected from damage by teammates. Even if Zhao Yuan was hit by Zhang Wen's magic attack, he would not be harmed. At the same time, the team can receive tasks corresponding to the number of people. Zhao Yuan said to the burly blacksmith, Uncle Blacksmith, I heard that the guards in our village are seriously short of weapons. I think the two of us can help. The blacksmith didn't look up, and continued to swing the huge square hammer to forge a red-hot sword embryo into shape. I do need help, I wonder if the two of you can do it. Of course we can, we're adults. How about this? The blacksmith finally looked at the two, I need a lot of grey wolf teeth and bones, which are very hard forging materials. As much material as you have, I will charge as much as the market price. System. The team has received the task of, collecting grey wolf corpse materials, and the time limit is 12 hours. The blacksmith pointed to the scrap furnace beside him, you are unarmed, and it is extremely dangerous to deal with grey wolves. Take one of the scrap weapons there. Zhao Yuan and Zhao Yuan were able to enter it after obtaining the blacksmith's permission. Zhao Yuan originally wanted to find a shield, but he didn't have such a big old weapon. 
he chose a long knife, and there was no staff here, so Zhang Wen chose a sword covered in rust. The advantage of this novice mission is that you can receive weapons for free, and the rewards of the mission correspond to the number of kills of the player. The more Wild Wolf Corpse materials collected, the richer the final reward will be. The two of them crossed the street and came to the gate of the village, where huge logs were used to build a four-meter high wall, and heavily armed guards were constantly patrolling the wall. There are players in the guard, but most of them are NPC. The Grey Wolf's area is in the north, let's go through the portal to the north. The two entered a blazing white teleportation point and were sent out of the village. At this point, the safe zone has been left, and fierce creatures can be seen everywhere in the wilderness. Once the player dies, they cannot be resurrected, and they are truly dead. Huge grey wolves appeared in the sight of the two of them one after another. Although they were only first-level monsters, they were about the size of tigers on Blue Star. Monsters in the wilderness don't have a hatred range. This is not an online game, but a doomsday game where life is the bet. 7. As long as grey wolves sensed humans, no matter how far away they were, they would attack. As soon as Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen appeared, the eyes of seven or eight grey wolves locked on to them and rushed towards them indiscriminately. 8 Level 1 Grey Wolves Zhao Yuan, are you sure you can resist them? And the sound of the battle will also attract other grey wolves to come. However, in order to monopolize the food, grey wolves generally do not choose to howl to attract the same kind. Zhang Wen raised the long sword, and the magic power circulated on the sword. He did not learn magic, and could only consume a small amount of magic to form a magic bullet to attack. Zhao Yuan stood in front alone, the SSS level anti-armor ability was a passive ability, and he only had the option of normal attack at this time. Roar, the tyrannical breath rushed towards the face, and ordinary people would have been so frightened that their bodies went limp when facing a creature of this size. Although Zhao Yuan was afraid, he trusted his SSS level anti-armor even more. Kang, Kang, the gray wolf's sharp fangs pierced Zhao Yuan's skin, but it shattered as if touching steel. There were only inconspicuous marks on Zhao Yuan's skin, not even abrasions. This is the defense provided by the SSS level anti-armor, these gray wolves can't break the defense at all. Zhao Yuan stabbed out the long knife, but the effect was minimal, but the real damage of the counter injury was extremely exaggerated. The gray wolf's health bar was directly reduced by a quarter, which was an attack that suffered real damage. The eight gray wolves violently attacked Zhao Yuan, their sharp claws and rough fangs fell on Zhao Yuan one after another. But his health bar was not obvious, but these grey wolves were pierced directly by the damage from the counter injury, their blood volume was emptied and they fell powerlessly to the ground. Kill the LV1 grey wolf, get 7 experience points. Use the anti-armor ability to gain 25 points of proficiency. Trigger the, billion times proficiency, talent, and the proficiency gain multiplier is increased to 1.6 times. Isn't this too violent? Zhang Wen didn't even release a few attacks before he found that the Grey Wolves had all fallen to the ground. Your reflection is based on the attacker's strength attribute, and it has a real damage effect. After this reflection, it is almost equivalent to the damage of a skill. Zhao Yuan also smiled and said, it's stronger than I imagined. My blood bar has hardly moved, which means it has dropped by about 1%. It seems that we can deal with more gray wolves. If we can attract 100 gray wolves, we will also be killed by counterattack within the same time. Zhang Ping pointed to the crooked neck tree not far away, I can climb up the tree, and you will attract hundreds of gray wolves. It's so cool to level up like this. Since the two accepted the task of collecting materials from gray wolf corpses, the dead gray wolves were automatically used as materials and put into their backpacks. And within the 12 hour time limit, the grids for storing gray wolf corpse materials are unlimited. The two moved their positions. The operation of climbing a tree didn't have much effect. Human beings can climb trees. How could these gray wolves not be able to climb them? But in this way, Zhao Yuan can run into the wolves without any scruples. The team set the contribution to divide the experience points. The 8 level 1 Grey Wolves just now provided Zhao Yuan with 13% of the experience points. Roar, several Grey Wolves found Zhao Yuan, and their bloodthirsty instinct made it rush towards Zhao Yuan, and then more Grey Wolves smelled the human scent. Some Grey Wolves found the blood of Grey Wolves on Zhao Yuan, 
so they raised their heads and howled, and the whole grassland was alarmed in an instant. The dense gray wolves were like a tide, and the only target was Zhao Yuan. Even some nearby players were alarmed, what happened? Could it be that some players are idiots who provoked so many monsters? Even level 5 players will be gnawed and killed by many level 1 gray wolves. This is a semi-digital world. If you lose your head, you will be instantly killed with full blood. Anyway, we don't want to die. It's the safest way to hunt the beasts cautiously and try not to make noise. There must be 200 of them, right? The 8 level 1 gray wolves just now caused Zhao Yuan to lose 1% of his health. Or Zhao Yuan's own level and ability level are too low, and the effect of this SSS level anti-armor is not fully exerted. Zhang Wen continued to condense magic power on the sword to create magic bullets. 7. Under the effect of the S level magic power enhancement, every time he attacks, he can take away two-thirds of the HP of the first level gray wolf, but it can only be a single attack. Zhao Yuan was still a little flustered. Hundreds of real gray wolves came flooding in. Although he knew he could guard against it, his fear would always emerge. He didn't use the long knife to attack either, he just used the knife to block his face, waiting for the wolves to attack. Bump, 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 Zhang Wen's magic bullet can almost instantly kill a level 1 gray wolf, but every time it leaves bloody skin, it can't really kill it instantly. Before the gray wolves attacked, they killed a lot. Boom, the densely packed gray wolves attacked Zhao Yuan frantically. Zhao Yuan was almost drowned by the gray wave, but Zhang Wen, who was a teammate, could see that Zhao Yuan's blood volume only dropped slightly. Puff, every time the attack fell on Zhao Yuan, it would have a corresponding counter-injury effect. Soon, a large number of gray wolf corpses fell at Zhao Yuan's feet. Zhao Yuan just stood there, the experience value soared wildly, and the corpse materials were automatically loaded into the backpack. The successors of the wolf pack have turned into Zhao Yuan's experience and proficiency. System. The player kills the LV1 gray wolf and gets 8 experience points. Players upgrade to LV2, all attributes will be improved. Trigger. Hundreds of thousands of mastery, the gain multiplier is increased to 1.8 times. The SSS level anti-armor proficiency has increased by 95 points, asterisk 1.8 times, and has been raised to LV3. Name, Zhao Yuan, Level, LV2, Talent, Eternal Blessing, Unique, All Skills Will Remain at SSS Level. Hundreds of millions of times of proficiency, Unique, the skill will cancel the level cap, and can be upgraded without restrictions. If you kill the target, you will continue to accumulate the multiplier of proficiency. Current proficiency multiplier, 1.8 times. Cornerstone ability. Anti-armor LV3 SSS level passively provides high physical defense and magic defense. When suffering damage, it reflects real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacker. Skills. None. Backpack. None. The rest of the panels have not been unlocked. A few more gray wolves were still attacking Zhao Yuan, and although these beasts possessed decent intelligence, being injured wouldn't hold them back. On the contrary, it will arouse the bloodthirsty instinct of the gray wolf, constantly and desperately bite Zhao Yuan, and other types of creatures may flee directly. Zhang Ping on the tree with crooked neck has been upgraded from level 0 to level 1, and his range is about 5 meters. The S-level cornerstone ability makes his attack power extremely exaggerated. If he gets range-type magic, the speed of spawning monsters will be even more outrageous. It's only been 6 minutes, we actually killed more than 200 gray wolves, and the time limit for this mission is 12 hours. At this speed, we may be able to reach level 5 here. Zhang Ping said expectantly. The corpse materials on the ground turned into streaks of black light and fell into Zhao Yuan's backpack. There were 213 corpse materials, which was equivalent to the results of 12 hours of other players. The Zhao Yuan attribute, which has been upgraded two levels in a row, has become stronger and stronger, especially the anti-armor of the SSS level has also been upgraded by two levels, and the passive defense value provided is higher. Let's go deeper. The area in front of us should be the level 2 gray wolf. The experience value provided by level 1 beasts is too low. The two of Zhao Yuan went deep into this area and saw more gray wolves, some of them were level 3, and most of them were level 2. Moreover, the terrain is plain, and a large number of gray wolves will be spotted at a glance. 
Every time you kill a gray wolf, you can get a few copper coins. It is unlikely to drop equipment, and the probability of dropping skill books is zero. Through the kill just now, the number of copper coins of Zhao Yuan has reached 423, and the plain terrain will make the players feel very tricky. Because it is easy to be discovered by a large number of fierce beasts and besieged to death, most players will choose to avoid plain terrain. But here just echoes Zhao Yuan's idea, the anti-armor of the SSS level has been upgraded to level 2, and the defense value provided passively has increased significantly. These level 2 and level 3 gray wolves can't break through the defense at all, instead they will be killed by counterattack. So the more beasts there are, the faster he will level up. Zhao Yuan approached the pack of gray wolves ostentatiously, staring at him with indifferent vertical pupils, as if worried about being robbed of food by the same kind, the gray wolves of level 2 and 3 rushed towards Zhao Yuan as if they were scrambling for food. This scene is shocking, and level 5 professionals will be overwhelmed by wolves in an instant. Zhao Yuan raised the long knife to protect his neck, after all, the damage at the weak point would increase a lot. Boom, countless gray wolves flocked to it, as if bait had been sprinkled into the fish pond, and the fish shoal was completely boiling. Zhang Wen only dared to stand at a distance, not even daring to attack, otherwise he would be affected too. Zhao Yuan felt like he was being bitten by mosquitoes all over his body, and at the same time, a large number of kill prompts sounded. The player successfully kills a level 2 gray wolf, gets 12 experience points, successfully kills a level 3 gray wolf, gets 25 experience points. Zhao Yuan roughly calculated that the gray wolf was an agile beast with high attack power but weak physique. With SSS level reflexes, 5 reflexes can kill a gray wolf. Ding, ding, ding. The wolves with gray fur fell down one by one, and the corpses turned into materials and entered Zhao Yuan's backpack. Zhang Wen didn't dare to come out to attack long range until the number of monsters decreased a lot. System. The player kills the gray wolf, triggers the talent, hundreds of millions of times proficiency, and the multiplier is increased to 2.0 times. The player successfully kills the target and gains 19 experience points, 0.2 copper coins. SSS level anti-armor proficiency increased by 251 points, asterisk 2.0, and the level was raised to LV4. The player's personal level has been raised to LV3. And Zhang Wen also successfully promoted to level 2, all attributes have been strengthened. Conditions for triggering hidden summoning. Kill 5,000 gray wolves, and the white-bellied wolf king will be summoned. Current progress. 987 five thousandths. There are also hidden summoning conditions. I wonder if the white-bellied wolf king is an elite monster or a lord monster. Zhang Wen asked curiously. Since your SSS level anti-armor is so powerful, it is estimated that the white-bellied wolf king can barely break through your defense. And after killing 5,000 gray wolves, our level may have reached LV5. While the attributes are improved, we can also acquire a small skill. Zhao Yuan nodded and said, Anyway, it's still early, so I'll keep brushing here. It's a pity that the bodies of the beasts can't overlap, otherwise hundreds of beasts can instantly trigger my anti-injury effect. At this time, a few humans in the distance witnessed the scene where Zhao Yuan and the two frantically killed the gray wolf. The person who fell into the pack of wolves with blood streaks that didn't move at all must be an SS level cornerstone talent. It's too perverted. It takes a few minutes for us to kill a gray wolf. And also get injured and risk being besieged by wolves. And he can kill hundreds of gray wolves in a few minutes without even a single trace on him. Another person muttered. They must have triggered the hidden conditions of the gray wolf plane. Killing 5000 gray wolves can summon the white-bellied wolf king. It's no secret. What, do you still want to fight their ideas? With our little combat power, are we going to die? Hey, we are not opponents, but the powerhouses of those organizations can easily kill these two people. The cruelty of the Doomsday game is not only reflected in the death of the player, which cannot be resurrected, but also in the inheritance system between players. When a player kills an enemy player, he or she can randomly inherit an opponent's cornerstone ability, and freely choose whether to replace the opponent's talent with his own cornerstone talent. You can choose to inherit, but when the enemy's talent is not as good as yours, you can choose to give up the inheritance. Therefore, it is common for players to fight each other in order to snatch powerful cornerstone abilities. 
In addition to the inheritance function, every once in a while, the novice village will encounter terrifying monsters attacking the village. If the defense is successful, all players in the novice village will be able to get rewards. If the resistance fails, the safe area will fall, and weak players will die directly under the impact of a large number of monsters. Whether it is an NPC or a player, only a few powerful people can survive and escape to other novice villages. 7K Wen Gua. In the process of this movement, it is also accompanied by danger. Of course the few of us are going to die, but I know people from the Huahu organization. If you sell them information, you can get a lot of copper money without risk. This method is very good. The eyes of the other people are shining, the role of copper coins is extremely important, and millions of copper coins will be spent instantly, becoming the player's combat power, so everyone is short of money. There are three of us here, and we need an intelligence fee of 5,000 copper coins. 5000 copper coins. Brother, you have to open the pattern. Anyway, it's intelligence, so what if there is a little error? Let's just say that this guy is an SSSS level talent, and we can't exchange it for an intelligence fee of 30,000 copper coins. Aren't we happy? Yes, the tall player smiled and said, it is understandable that there are errors in the information. Even if it is not the cornerstone ability of the SSSS level, the Huahu organization will not be able to retaliate against us. The 30,000 copper coins are acceptable to them, within range. It's settled like this, these two people still have to fill 5,000 in the Grey Wolf Plane, and they won't leave in a short time. After Zhao Yuan's improvement, his defense power soared again, and he could lie flat on this Grey Wolf Plane without any scruples, although the level of experience required a lot. But he kills hundreds of times faster than normal players. Zhang Wen also kept attacking behind Zhao Yuan, the S-level magic power was strengthened, and his magic return attribute and magic value attribute were also increased, so he would not be empty. The area of this Grey Wolf Plane is very broad, Zhao Yuan continued to penetrate, and a large number of Grey Wolves found Zhao Yuan, biting frantically, only to injure themselves to death. Zhang Wen looked from a distance, Zhao Yuan was wrapped into a mass by a large number of beasts, but every second the corpse of the Grey Wolf rolled down. Zhao Yuan's long knife has been completely broken, and its durability is zero, but Zhao Yuan doesn't need this weapon anymore, so he just stands there, even in the weak spots such as the eyes, neck, and back of the head. The Grey Wolf was also unable to break the defense, indicating that Zhao Yuan's defense had completely crushed these creatures. That's too cool, isn't it? Zhang Wen watched as the killing progress continued to increase, and he had already killed 2,965 Grey Wolves. The anti-methyl stone ability that everyone will immediately eliminate is so heaven-defying. Zhao Yuan responded in the system voice. Most people really don't choose this anti-methyl stone, because after their own defense and health are piled up, anti-injury can only do so much damage. And the beast's attack will cause obvious pain, but my current defense is completely crushed, so there is almost no pain. You have to rely on your own injuries to cause damage to the enemy, and you only choose this cornerstone option if you have a sick brain. Even if some shield defense players trained by the guild are specially used to open up wasteland dungeons, they will not choose anti-armor. It is more appropriate to choose to taunt to attract the enemy's attack. Zhang Wen said with a smile. That is to say, your SSS level anti-armor is anti-armor. Low level anti-armor does not increase defense at all, and you are still anti-injury of real damage. Zhao Yuan was already too leisurely, the Grey Wolf's frenzied attack didn't even feel any pain to him, but under the reflection of the real damage, a large number of them fell down. Kill Progress 4583 5 thousandths System Players kill LV3 Grey Wolves, get 19 experience points, and get 3 copper coins. Trigger the, billion times proficiency, talent, and the acquisition multiple will be increased to 2.2 times. SSS level anti-armor gains 695 proficiency points asterisk 2.2 times upgraded to level 6. The player's personal level has been raised to LV4, and the attributes of the whole body have been strengthened. Name, Zhao Yuan. Level, LV4. Talent, Eternal Blessing, Unique, All Skills will remain at SSS level. Hundreds of millions of proficiency, Unique, the skill will cancel the level cap and can be upgraded without limit. 
Killing the target will continuously accumulate the proficiency acquisition multiple, current proficiency multiple, 2.2 times. Cornerstone ability. Anti-armor LV6 SSS level, passively provide high physical defense and magic defense. When suffering damage, reflect the real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacking party. Skills. None. Backpack. No. Copper coins. 13,923 pieces. The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. Zhang Wen also just reached level 3, and at the same time, the S-level magic power enhancement is a passive effect, and he has also gained a lot of skill proficiency and the level has been raised to level 3. There are still a few hundred left, and the white-bellied wolf king can be summoned. I'm really looking forward to it. Ordinary wild monsters will basically not drop equipment, but elite monsters and lord creatures may drop equipment. Zhang Wen was excited. Road. With a meat shield like Zhao Yuan attracting damage in front, he almost attacked all the way, without much evasion from beasts. Is there anything more reliable than having a tank buddy against the sky in a doomsday game? No wonder the people in Novice Village need several months to reach level 10, and then teleport to the town. This upgrade requires too much experience points, Zhao Yuan said casually. More than 5,000 level 3 Grey Wolves can't be upgraded to level 5. The average player can only hunt dozens of beasts a day, which is already at a mid-level level. Zhang Wen rolled his eyes, are you content? The SSS level is anti-armor, and it will be upgraded to level 4 in 3 hours. Others will not be envious. Are you sure it's an SSS level ability? The vice captain of the Huahu organization doubted in the chat channel. Of course, there is nothing wrong with it. I also recorded a video. You can watch it for yourself. One person fights against hundreds of level 3 gray wolves, and the health bar does not move at all. This is at least SS level, and SSS level is not impossible. Brother Fujun, we have a good relationship, I just told you the first time, otherwise I can sell this information to the other two organizations. Fujun, the vice captain of the Huahu organization, responded, the coordinates are sent, how much copper do you want? 30,000 copper coins. 30,000. Fu Jun thought that Mylan and the Shangui organization would compete with him, so he stopped haggling. Okay, I'll give you 50,000 copper coins, but you have to guarantee that this is exclusive information. I don't want to meet people from the Shangui and Mylan organization at the coordinates. I understand the rules, don't worry, brother Fu Jun, but you'd better come here as soon as possible, otherwise this kid will be promoted to level 5 soon. The tall player said enviously. I watched him go from level 2 to level 4 within a few hours, which will probably summon the white-bellied wolf king. I'll come right away. Fu Jun called a team of members of the organization and rushed towards the coordinates. The information has been sold. According to the rules, each person is 10,000 copper coins, which is enough for us to increase our combat power. The tall player did not mention that Fu Jun raised the intelligence fee to 50,000. Hey, do we want to sell it to Mylan and the Shangui organization? Sell one information to the three. Forget it, there is a life to sell, but a lifeless flower. If we really want to do something like this, there will be no place for us in the entire Shinsho village. Killing progress. 5,000 five thousandths, level 5 white-bellied wolf king will be summoned. Zhao Yuan glanced at his experience points, and he was still short of level 5. However, the SSS level anti-armor level was already very high, so it shouldn't be a big problem to fight the white-bellied wolf king alone. Roar. In the open space of the plain, a magic circle engraved with a mysterious logo lit up, and a huge wolf king stepped out of it. It was twice the size of the average gray wolf and had smooth gray fur with white hair on its belly. 7. white belly wolf king. Level. LV5. Quality. Elite. Skills. Bloodletting, Tear. Introduction. The king on the plane has amazing agility and lethality. Enemies bitten by him will die. Here we come. Zhao Yuan cheered up, while Zhang Wen withdrew far away, let's see if Zhao Yuan can hold back. Otherwise, the elite monsters will ignore the front row and kill the crispy mage instantly. Zhao Yuan didn't even see the white-bellied wolf king's movements clearly, a black shadow enveloped himself, and the huge fangs had already touched Zhao Yuan's skin. Kang, the wolf king's teeth cracked directly, and his blood volume was significantly reduced. 
Zhao Yuan's own blood volume only decreased by 1%, while the Wolf King lost 10% of his blood volume in an instant. This is because the power attribute of the Wolf King is very high, and it is even more terrifying after being converted into real damage reflection. This is the terrible thing about SSS level anti-armor, the elite monsters of level 5 can still barely break through the defense. A scar appeared on the Wolf King's body, and blood continued to flow out, which aroused its ferocity. Tear, the Wolf King directly bit Zhao Yuan's body, shaking his head frantically and tearing at him. If it was an ordinary player, he would have been torn in half and cut in half. But Zhao Yuan still only lost a little HP, and because the damage was so low, he barely felt pain. Puff, a bigger scar appeared on the Wolf King's body, which was the anti-armor's reflection of the tearing skill. Very well, this guy doesn't have too much wisdom yet, and doesn't understand the anti-damage attribute. It won't run away. If the Wolf King really wants to run away, I may not be able to complete the repair. Zhao Yuan sent a voice to Zhang Wendao. Now the Wolf King's hatred is all on me. You can try to attack and share the experience. Otherwise, the whole Wolf King's experience will be counted on my head. Zhang Wen began to release magic bullets, the damage was still considerable, and the Wolf King's health bar began to decline rapidly. This is because the Wolf King unleashes the bleeding skill, which can deal multiple damages to Zhao Yuan. This means that Zhao Yuan's anti-armor can be counter-injured many times. Puff puff. One after another scars appeared all over the Wolf King's body, and the smooth fur at the beginning was no longer there, and the injury was in jeopardy. At the same time, Fu Jun brought seven eighth-level team members and kept coming here. The newcomer on this video is really scary. The minimum is the SS level cornerstone ability. After killing it and inheriting it, I can have the SS level cornerstone ability. Fu Jun's eyes are frantic, knowing that he is only a C level cornerstone ability, and he has achieved the position of the vice captain of the Huahu organization. It is conceivable how attractive the SS level cornerstone is to him. As long as anyone kills Zhao Yuan, he can instantly become a top end player, but all this is based on the premise that Zhao Yuan has not yet grown up. Zhang, Clank, the Wolf King waved his claws frantically, and the counter injury effect directly emptied his health bar. The whole process only took five minutes. Boom, a sticky golden light descended on Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen. Zhao Yuan successfully reached level 5 and acquired a small skill. System, the player successfully killed the 5th level white-bellied wolf king, and gained 852 experience points, 251 copper coins, and one piece of white equipment. The player's personal level is raised to LV5, all attributes are improved, and the S-level skill, taunt, is obtained. Affected by, eternal blessing, all skills will be kept at the SSS level, and the S-level mockery will be promoted to the SSS level. Successfully triggers the talent, hundreds of thousands of times proficiency, and the gain multiplier is increased to 2.5 times. SS's level anti-armor gains 982 proficiency points asterisk 2.5 times which is increased to LV8. A lot of system information sounded, but Zhao Yuan checked his first active skill for the first time. Draw taunt LV1 SSS level passively increase the monster's hatred value, after the active release, charge forward for a distance, causing area damage, and taunting enemies within 50 meters for 5 seconds. This is a very large taunt skill with a short cooldown and can be used frequently. The acquisition of small skills generally matches the ability of the cornerstone, taunt plus counter injury, and in the face of intelligent creatures, you can also madly perform real damage reflection. The anti-armor of the SSS level has been raised to level 8, which can provide higher dual resistance attributes. After killing the white-bellied wolf queen, a white quality oak shield is obtained. After Zhao Yuan equipped it, he realized that the shield was only the size of a small washbasin and could barely cover his face and neck. However, shield equipment can provide defensive attributes, making Zhao Yuan harder. Name, Zhao Yuan, Level, LV5, Talent, Eternal Blessing, Unique, All skills will remain at SSS level. Hundreds of millions of times of proficiency, Unique, the skill will cancel the level cap and can be upgraded without limit. Killing the target will continuously accumulate the multiplier of proficiency, current proficiency multiplier, 2.5 times. Cornerstone Ability 
Anti-Armor LV-8 SSS level passively provides high physical defense and magic defense. When receiving damage, it reflects real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacker. Skill. Draw a knife to taunt LV-1 SSS level passively increase the monster's hatred value. After the active release, charge forward for a certain distance and apply a taunting effect to the enemy 50 meters away for 5 seconds. Backpack. Oak shield white. Copper coins. 16,692 pieces. The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. Zhang Wen also had a thick golden glow on his body, and he was successfully upgraded to level 4. He also gained a lot of proficiency in the S-level magic power increase. A level 5 elite geek drops a piece of white equipment, the drop rate is too low. Zhao Yuan said. Zhang Wen's face was full of excitement, we are lucky to lose a piece of white equipment. How many people have left the novice village and only have two or three pieces of white equipment? The Wolf King falls, and the beasts in this area will recede for three hours. Zhao Yuan looked at the more than 5,000 units of Grey Wolf Corpse materials in his backpack, plus the corpse of the white-bellied Wolf King, which can definitely be exchanged for a lot of rewards at the blacksmith. It's only been four hours, and the wild wolves in this area have been temporarily hidden. Although there will be wolf creatures in other areas, but the distance is too far, we will return to the village and turn in the task. Zhang Wen also nodded in agreement and said, I'm still 60% short of experience before I can reach level 5, and then I can get the first active skill. A team of 8 players rushed in front of the two. Are you late? The white-bellied wolf king was killed so quickly. I remember that it took 30 minutes to kill 10 people. Fu Jun changed his mind. He originally wanted to take advantage of the fierce battle between Zhao Yuan and the white-bellied wolf king to sneak attack on Zhao Yuan, so as to inherit Zhao Yuan's SSS level cornerstone ability. But Zhao Yuan's strength is stronger than he imagined, how long has it passed? Killed a level 5 elite monster in a few minutes. And Zhao Yuan has been upgraded to level 5, and his strength has been strengthened again. Fu Jun looked at the 7 level 8 players he brought with him and felt that he was not an opponent. Although he is greedy, he is more afraid of death, and he is not likely to be Zhao Yuan's opponent, so Fu Jun said with a smile. You two, we have no ill intentions, we just want to invite you to join the Hua Hu organization. We are organized between towns and are also a great force. Today we have the action of reclaiming the wasteland. Do you two want to join us? The rewards of the dungeon are extremely rich, and there are even potions that increase permanent attributes. Zhao Yuan said, no need, we brothers are used to it and don't want to join other organizations. What's the matter? Didn't the deputy captain bring us to kill? Why did he suddenly become cowardly? A member of the Hua Hu organization thought in confusion. Wait, the wolf creatures here have disappeared. This is the follow-up effect of the white-bellied wolf king being killed. Did these two people complete the killing of the white-bellied wolf king? It's no wonder that the vice captain suddenly became cowardly. He's not an opponent at all, even though it's only a level 5 and a level 4. Fu Jun was rejected and did not respond, he said with a smile. You can think about it first, there are various benefits for joining the organization, and it has only been less than 5 days for monsters to attack the village, you can also get a lot of rewards for guarding the village. Then we will leave. Fu Jun took the members and fled here. Zhang Wen said cautiously, it seems to be here to kill us, right? The Doomsday game has an inheritance function. In addition to inheriting the cornerstone ability of the dead player, killing people can also obtain the player's items and copper coins. This guy should have guessed that the two of us killed the white-bellied wolf king, and he knew that he was not an opponent, so he left. Zhao Yuan said casually, I still wanted to try my new skills, but this person turned out to be cowardly, but this is reasonable. Who is not afraid of death? I chose the ability to reverse armor because I was afraid of death. The two returned the same way, past the teleportation point, and returned to No. 401 Novice Village. When he came to the blacksmith, Zhao Yuan handed over a large amount of Grey Wolf Corpse materials to the blacksmith. This, 5,342 pieces of Grey Wolf Corpse material. How long have you two been out of the village? You killed so many beasts. The Uncle Blacksmith looked at the corpse materials in surprise, okay, great. There will be a large number of beasts attacking the village in five days. With these wild wolf corpse materials, I can make a lot of bone arrows. 
Arrow. Wait, is this the corpse of the white-bellied wolf king? The blacksmith was completely shocked. You all survived from the mouth of the white-bellied wolf king. Using the wolf king's corpse materials, I can create white-quality equipment. 7. I have the precious potion of the old potion next door, and I will give it to you as a reward. The task of gathering gray wolf corpse materials has been completed, and you have obtained 4,562 experience points, 6,000 copper coins, blood activating potion 2, and white equipment 1. Zhao Yuan continued to talk to Uncle Blacksmith, but there were no new quests to trigger. Vitality Elixir permanently increases the maximum health by 10 points after use. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen each have a bottle. Although the upper limit of 10 health points seems to be very small, the permanent increase is also very precious. White Paper Lantern Quality White Type Staff Effect Intelligence Attribute Plus 3 Introduction An extremely common lantern made of white paper, which can illuminate a limited area at night. The experience points rewarded by the quest did not allow the two to level up, and the white paper lantern was given to Zhang Wen, because he was a spellcaster and this equipment Zhao Yuan could not use either. It's still early, we can try the copy of Wasteland, Zhao Yuan suggested. Really or not, Wasteland Dungeon, that requires 10 people to form a team, and they are all level 10 full before they choose to go to Wasteland Dungeon. In this way, no one has been able to successfully open up Wasteland. Zhang Wen refused with a full face. Zhao Yuan had no choice but to send Zhang Wen his SSS level taunting attribute map. It's SSSS again. Have you hung up? Zhang Wen was surprised. Zhao Yuan opened his mouth to analyze. Even if it is a level 10 creature in the copy, it is difficult to break my defense. The higher the attack, the better my counter injury effect. Maybe when we get to the booze, we are all close to level 8, and I can gain a lot of skill proficiency along the way. Two SSS level skills are enough to clear the level. Indeed, there are not many SSS levels in the entire Sha Kingdom. Zhao Yuan's current strength is higher than he imagined. Zhang Wen thought about it carefully, and the possibility of customs clearance is very high. After all, the SSS level taunt and the SSS level anti-armor, the higher the boosts attack, the higher the blood loss. Regional Announcement Huang Xian, a player in No. 403 Novice Village, used the Gambling Order to initiate a bet against No. 401 Novice Village. The one who successfully passes the village dungeon first, all players will receive permanent attribute bonuses, the resources in the Novice Village are doubled, and the difficulty of monster attacking the village is reduced. For the side that fails the bet, all player attributes will be permanently reduced, the resources in the novice village will be halved, and the difficulty of monster attacking will increase. The first player who successfully passes the village copy will receive a special reward. The chat channels of No. 401 Novice Village and No. 403 Novice Village have been opened. Gambling orders. There are such items, Zhao Yuan said. The losing side is miserable. All players' attributes are reduced. The resources of the novice village are reduced by half, and the most important thing is that the difficulty of monster attacking the village increases. Sended. The teleportation point will also fail, and the time spent on the road is unimaginable. Zhang Wen said solemnly. Then we have to enter the village dungeon too, time is running out. Zhao Yuan used copper coins to buy some food and tents in the system mall. The village copy generally takes more than four days, and this is still the progress of 10 level 10 players. Zhao Yuan, think clearly, the minimum level 8 creatures in the dungeon are, and the boosters are even 10th level lord creatures. If they die, they cannot be resurrected. Zhang Wen finally said. In the mocking state, the target can only choose me to attack, you don't have to worry at all, just open the copy. The two reached a consensus and walked towards the village chief's hut. The only copy of the novice village was to defeat a seriously injured lord creature together with the village chief. But the difficulty is very high, and no one has ever successfully cleared the level. These 10 level players have no choice but to leave the novice village and transfer to the town. And after leaving the novice village, there is no way to return. After finding the village chief, Zhao Yuan said straight to the point, Village chief, we want to enter the dungeon. The village chief is dressed in dark leather armor and has a mustache. Two people, not even level 10, 
Are you going to die? Although other novice villages have opened the gambling order, it is definitely a dead end with the two of you alone. We are sure to enter the dungeon. Zhao Yuan said calmly. This is your freedom. The village chief pushed the seat behind him, and a teleportation point was revealed. But I will only choose the strong team and help them complete the dungeon. The two of Zhao Yuan stepped into the teleportation point and entered the copy. This old man looks down on us and will only choose a team of 10 players from level 10 to join. Zhang Wen said helplessly. All right, the two of us are enough. Zhao Yuan opened the chat channel and found that the chat channels of No. 401 Xinxiang Village and No. 403 Xinxiang Village were merged together. I'm going, who is Huang Xian? Playing so fiercely. If we lose this bet, won't our No. 403 Xinxian Village suffer? I won't talk about the lowering of attributes and the halving of resources. These will cause players to die slowly, but the monsters have been attacking the village for a few days. It is already difficult to guard. If the difficulty increases, there will be no safe zone. Upstairs, Huang Xian is the captain of the Wild Fox organization. It is said that he is a strong B-level cornerstone ability. He has formed a powerful 10-person team, and the copy of the Wasteland is guaranteed. You, Huang. Oh, Huang Xian is really bullish. Come on, Huang Xian, or no. 403 Novice Village depends on you. A player of No. 403 Novice Village who insulted Huang Xian instantly changed his face and became a supporter of Huang Xian, one side. The captain of the Mountain Ghost organization sent a message. This is the same route, why is it too urgent? Why did you choose our number? 401 Novice Village is the bet target. Huang Xian. I said I was the one I chose at random, do you believe it? The player of No. 401 Novice Village said. Huang Xian must be for a special reward after the successful bet. He was going to take the copy and play the bet. This is terrible, no one on our side has started to organize a team to open up a copy of the Wasteland. Huang Xian entered the dungeon with an elite team of 10 people, with a calm expression on his face. This pair of betting orders was given to me by my cousin. My cousin's strategy mentioned that if you complete the betting in Novice Village, you can get a powerful magic weapon, which can enable the magic weapon function in advance. This magic weapon, I'm going to fix it. In No. 401 Novice Village, three organizations that were originally fighting against each other, Huahu, Shangui, and Mylan, joined forces to select the top 10 players to open up a dungeon. If you want to leave the Novice Village, you must go through a monster attack, so these level 10 players are ready to conquer this dungeon desperately, before Huang Xian. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen entered a pitch black burrow with torches on both sides as light sources, which seemed to go out at any time under the blowing of the overcast wind. 7. Zhang Wen is carrying a white paper lantern, which can also provide some light. In the mud in front, silhouettes passed by one after another, Zhao Yuan directly released his sword and taunted and rushed into the silhouettes. The creatures in the vicinity of 50 meters were all taunted by Zhao Yuan and began to attack Zhao Yuan frantically. Blood Slave. Level. LV8. Quality. Ordinary. Skill. Vampire. Introduction. The lowest level vampires, not recognized by vampires, are lowly creatures that only exist in dark corners. Zhao Yuan got closer to see clearly that these creatures were like the lowest level of vampires, transformed from villagers. Zhao Yuan raised an oak shield and blocked it in front of his face, allowing the numerous blood slaves to attack him. Zhao Yuan's taunting with his sword attracted hundreds of level 8 blood slaves, who still couldn't really break the defense in front of the LV-8 SSS anti-armor. Zhao Yuan was as hard as a piece of steel, shattering the claws of all the enemies. Puff, 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 under the effect of SSS level anti-armor, a large number of blood slaves died, and every attack of the enemy could not break the defense against Zhao Yuan, but would take away a quarter of his own blood. Especially when the blood slave releases the blood sucking skill, it absorbs three blood in a row, and it will reflect the damage three times. And Zhao Yuan's magic defense was as terrible as his physical defense, and he didn't lose a drop of blood. It's good that the blood slave does not release the blood sucking skills. Once released, it will instantly kill himself. Zhao Yuan was like a hedgehog, and a large number of blood slaves fell to the ground, which became Zhao Yuan's experience and skill proficiency. 
Zhang Wen was not idle either, the white paper lantern in his hand kept condensing magic bullets, and kept attacking behind Zhao Yuan. And with the passive effect of drawing a knife and mocking, no blood slave will bypass Zhao Yuan and attack Zhang Wen. Level 8 monsters provide very rich experience points. After killing a hundred of them, Zhang Wen has risen to level 5. He acquired a skill, Summoning Bones, S level. Zhao Yuan asked curiously, What skills did you acquire, so excited? What level? S level Summoning Bones. Summoning Bones LV1 S level, you can use the corpses killed by players or teammates as materials to summon bones, and the current upper limit of summoning is 100 units. It's the hidden points system. Zhang Wen said excitedly. Except for the first cornerstone option, which is random, every skill acquired in the future is determined by the player's hidden points. I followed you, the SSS level boss, and made the hidden points very high, so I got the S level skills. Otherwise, small skills will generally be lower than the cornerstone ability level. All actions of each player, including the ratio of receiving damage, output ratio, avoiding damage, will be included in the player's hidden score. It can allow players with low initial cornerstone abilities to acquire more powerful skills, and it may also allow players with S-level initial cornerstones to subsequently obtain C-level and B-level skills. Zhang Wen immediately released the S-level summoning bone, and strange and complicated patterns appeared on his white paper lantern. The corpse of the blood slave on the ground began to move obviously, as if larva were tearing the skin, the flesh and blood of the blood slave was torn apart, and a white bone came out from it. 1, 2, 3. Soon, 100 level 8 bones climbed up and became Zhang Wen's summoned creatures. There is no time limit. As long as they are not destroyed, these bone creatures can keep fighting. Zhang Wen began to manipulate the bones to attack the blood slave. Bone creatures can inherit 50% of the corpse's attributes, which is already very strong. Cold flames were ignited in the eye sockets of each bone, standing near Zhao Yuan, attacking the blood slave frantically. Since this is a copy of 10 people, the number of monsters is extremely exaggerated. Even 10 people will need a few days to completely kill these blood slaves. But Zhao Yuan's anti-armor was too terrifying. The higher the enemy's attack attribute, the higher the damage of the anti-injury, and layers of corpses kept falling. The follow-up blood slaves rushed towards Zhao Yuan, and the enemies fell one by one like wheat. The Mylan, Shangui, and Huahu organizations selected the 10 strongest players, and were approved by the village chief, who also joined the team and began to kill blood slaves continuously. However, the blood-sucking skill of the blood slave is extremely tricky. It will not only cause three stages of high damage, but will also be converted into blood to restore the life value of the blood slave. The village chief's team struggled to kill the blood slaves, and it took a minute to completely kill a blood slave. Fortunately, there was area damage in the team. Huang Xian has a B-level bloodthirsty talent, is the most powerful output point in the team, and can act as the front row. The progress is very fast, far crushing the 10-man team in the 401 novice village. Zhao Yuan really couldn't be more leisurely, the blood slave's attack didn't feel any pain at all, he just stood there, and his experience points increased crazily. 7. System Killing a level 8 blood slave triggers the talent, hundreds of millions of times proficiency, and the multiplier is increased to 3.0 times. Kill a level 8 blood slave, get 65 experience points, 55 experience points. SSS anti-armor gains 65 proficiency points, 42 proficiency points, 63 proficiency points asterisk 3.0 times. The SSS level anti-armor is increased to LV10, and the SSS level sword drawing taunt is increased to LV4. Name, Zhao Yuan. Level, LV5. Talent, Eternal Blessing, Unique, All Skills will remain at SSS level. Hundreds of millions of proficiency, Unique, the skill will cancel the level cap and can be upgraded without limit. Killing the target will continuously accumulate the proficiency acquisition multiple, current proficiency multiple, 3.0 times. Cornerstone Ability. Anti-Armor LV10, SSS level, passively provide high physical defense and magic defense. When suffering damage, reflect the real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacking party. Skill. Draw a knife and taunt LV4, SSS level, passively increase the monster's hatred value. After the active release, 
charge forward for a certain distance, and apply the taunt effect to enemies 80 meters away for 5 seconds. Backpack. Oak shield white. Copper coins. 21,005 pieces. The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. After the bone creature summoned by Zhang Wen was destroyed, he immediately summoned the bones from the new corpse, and also gained a lot of skill proficiency. The upper limit of summoning bones at level 3 is already 150 units. The blood slaves fell like a tide. After 5 hours of fierce battle, Zhao Yuan and the two finally killed all the blood slaves. Zhao Yuan has also been upgraded to level 6, and he can reach level 7 with a little experience, and Zhang Wen has just stepped into level 6. Because it is a copy, the corpse of the blood slave does not drop copper coins, but only provides skill proficiency and experience points. Zhao Yuan's SSS level anti-armor was finally raised to level 14, and his sword-drawn mockery reached level 9. Zhang Wen's magic power has been enhanced to level 6, and the bone summoning has been raised to level 5. Zhao Yuan opened his mouth and said, it's not difficult at all. Time is running out, we won't rest, let's just kill it, and let's talk about gambling. Zhang Wen is also very leisurely. He embarked on the path of the summoner, which is easier than Zhao Yuan. He has been lying on the ground and resting for the past 5 hours. Thanks to this S-level magic power enhancement, otherwise I would not have so much magic value to release skills. Zhang Wen took out a bread purchased in a system store and said while eating. Wait for me to see, where is the number? 403 Novice Village, the Huang Xian who initiated the gambling. Huang Xian. Everyone, our team has passed the first stage of the dungeon, and the second stage is officially opened. This gambling reward is definitely ours. Since I dare to use this item, I must have absolute confidence. I have thoroughly studied the boosting style of this dungeon, and I can easily clear the level without dying alone. It's great. Come on, Huang Xian, I'm still waiting for the end of the betting, all the attributes will be strengthened, and the resources will be doubled. In a suitable leveling area, the number of monsters is also limited. If the resources are doubled, the strength of the entire novice village will be improved in disguise. No, 403 novice village is already winning, and no, 401 novice village is tense. Although the players could not see the specific situation, one of the 10 players who entered the dungeon had already died. In the dungeon, even with the assistance of the village chief, these huge numbers of blood slaves are still very difficult to deal with. The deputy captain of the Mountain Ghost organization died like this, and he didn't even have a chance to rescue him. This blood slave is too perverted, isn't it? Not to mention the high damage after the release of blood sucking, and can restore a small half of the blood bar, how to fight this? If we continue to fight, we will all die. This is only the first stage, and there are the second and third stages, as well as the final stage of facing the Lord Creature. Instead of dying, it's better to be prepared to meet the monsters attacking the village after the difficulty has increased. The belief in the team has been broken, and the three captains are also thinking about whether to quit the dungeon. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen passed through the pitch-black corridor and came to the midst of the rocks. At intervals, a torch was fixed on the wall, emitting a dark green fire. Zhao Yuan saw a crow, its wings were blood-red, its pupils were full of tyranny, and then countless eyes lit up in the darkness. Vampire Crow. Quality. Ordinary. Level. LV9. Skill. Sprint. Introduction. The pets raised by the blood family have mutated into powerful creatures. Zhao Yuan directly turned on the SSS level, drawing taunt, and the whole person turned into an afterimage, dashed into the crows, and instantly killed seven or eight blood crows. Taunt all the enemies within 100 meters, followed by the familiar operation, standing and opening the chat channel, the blood crow still launched an attack on himself. Sprint. The blood crow vibrated its wings and swooped towards Zhao Yuan, but was directly pierced by the counter injury and became a corpse. The damage of the sprint is very high, especially when hundreds of blood crows sprint at the same time. This scene is extremely scary. The average player will be instantly killed by the fire, and there is no possibility to avoid it. Zhang Wen also controlled his own army of bones, attacking frantically. Huang Xian's team has reached the second stage. Like us, we don't know if we can catch up. Zhao Yuan ignored the crazy dive of the Blood Crow. They are a 10-man team of level 10, and they are well-equipped. Especially this Huang Xian, 
who has already reached level 10, has prepared for this dungeon for more than 10 days, and the one-time props have been produced in batches. Zhang Wen he waved the white paper lantern and summoned the corpses of several blood crows out of bird bones. And there are only two of us, not even level 8, and the village chief doesn't help us. Even if the village is breached by monsters and the safe area falls, the two of us can easily go to other novice villages with our strength. But the NPCs and players in the entire village are estimated to have died in the mouth of the monster. Although they are NPCs, they are no different from real humans. I even think these NPCs are real life. Zhao Yuan watched the crow's bones crawled out of the corpse, and it could even fly, using the same sprinting skills to attack. What is that? Zhao Yuan saw a man in black flash past, and then three arrows shot at Zhang Wen. Not good. Zhang Wen has always been in a relaxed state, and he may be instantly killed by these three arrows. Zhao Yuan instantly released, drawing a knife and taunting, sprinting in front of Zhang Wen, blocking the three arrows. Puff. There were three more bloody wounds on the man in black in the distance, and he fled in pain. It's so dangerous, I almost got it. Zhang Wen then reacted, I almost forgot that I was brushing the dungeon. Summoning creatures only requires simple manipulation, and they are almost regarded as ordinary monsters. Who is this man in black? It should be a blood race creature. Anyway, he was not feeling well. He was directly injured three times, and he was already seriously injured. After six hours, Zhao Yuan's spirit was completely exhausted. Fortunately, he didn't need to concentrate, he only needed to rush into the blood crows to retaliate wildly. If it wasn't for being attacked by an unknown archer, Zhang Wen would have started to sleep and rest now, because the passive effect of Zhao Yuan's taunting with his knife was also extremely powerful, Zhang Wen had been completely ignored. System. Players kill level 8 blood crows to obtain 102 experience points, 113 experience points, and 123 experience points, which have been upgraded to LV7. Kill the target, trigger the talent, hundreds of millions of times the proficiency, and the gain is 3.3 times. SS's level anti-armor gains 7,652 skill proficiency points asterisk 3.3 times which is increased to LV19. The SSS level sword drawing taunt has been increased to LV15. Zhang Wen has also been successfully upgraded to level 6, and both skills have gained a lot of proficiency. The S-level bone summoning has reached level 9, and the upper limit of summoning has reached 350. With the fall of the last vampire crow, there is no more enemy in this rocky area. And Zhang Wen already owned an army of bone crows. How about it, can you still handle it? As a summoner, I can be regarded as the easiest profession, and all the attacks can be left to the summoned creatures. Zhang Wen asked. Indeed, in this doomsday game where injuries will feel real pain, and death cannot be revived, summoner is the most suitable choice. If you take the meat shield route, you can't avoid being attacked by monsters frantically, and the pain is unbearable. If you take the long-range output route, you don't need to fight monsters in close quarters. Most of the monsters have high intelligence and will choose to skip the meat shield and assassinate the back row. And summoners don't need to fight monsters in close quarters, but they can also summon flesh shield creatures to protect themselves, and they can upgrade while standing, which is really cool. I can still hold on. Although my energy has dropped a bit, I just pay attention to releasing a taunt skill. Fill your stomach, and we will start the third stage. Zhao Yuan took out a steaming pancake fruit from his backpack. The price is not expensive, only 20 copper coins, which can restore physical strength and replenish hunger. Let's not talk about anything else, this pancake fruit is really good. Zhao Yuan ate while browsing the chat channel after the merger of the two Xinxiu villages. Huang Xian. Brothers, we have finished the second stage, rest in the dungeon for one night, and continue to open up Wasteland tomorrow. Boss Huang Xian, be careful of possible attacks in the dungeon at night. As long as there are no accidents, we will win this bet. The land reclamation team in Novice Village 401 was formed temporarily. I heard that they are stuck in the second stage. Two players died. Originally, a team of 10 people couldn't pass the second stage. Now that there are two less people, it is even more impossible to pass the second stage. Nice. The rewards for winning the bet are too generous, and I can't wait. Don't worry upstairs, this kind of copy with 10 people needs to be played for 4 or 5 days. 
Boss Huang Xian spent a lot of money in advance to make a large number of Molotov cocktails, and passed the second stage on the first day, easily burning the tree people in the second stage. The village dungeon has four stages in total. The more difficult it is, the more difficult it is, as long as you are stable, Mr. Huang Xian. Player from Novice Village 401, this is a lost game. Our land reclamation team is completely stuck in the second stage. Hundreds of blood crows dive at the same time, who can hold it? If it wasn't for the assistance of the village chief, more than two people would have died. Can we just admit defeat? The punishment for losing the bet is too severe. The reduction of attributes, the halving of resources, and the increase in the difficulty of monsters attacking the stronghold are all punishments that will lead us to slow death. Then what else can I do? I'm not as strong as others, so I can only bite the bullet and bear the punishment. In my opinion, it's better for the land reclamation team to withdraw from the dungeon and retain their combat power. We are ready for the monsters to attack the village next time, and there is still a glimmer of hope for survival. That's right, stop the loss in time, and if you rush to the dungeon again, you will die. Anyway, you will definitely lose, and there is no need to struggle. 7. In the dungeon, the leader of the Mylan organization said, Our Mylan people quit, this is simply death, we can't even beat the second stage, let alone the final booze battle. Don't let me meet this Huang Xian in the future, or I will avenge my dead companion sooner or later. Hey, after this bet, this Huang Xian's battle strength must have greatly increased, so what if we meet him again? I can't beat him, the captain of the Mountain Ghost organization said. I'm quitting too, if I want to hit you, hit yourself. The village chief shook his head. Sure enough, no one can kill the final blood race. Zhang Wen and Zhao Yuan continued on their way after eating and drinking. They were not like Huang Xian's team. Everyone has to avoid the enemy's damage, to move, to choose a weak point to attack, to prevent the back row from being raided, and to pay attention to their mana. Already exhausted, he had to rest for one night before continuing to fight. This was mental fatigue. Even the strong after rank 4 or 5 still needed sleep and rest. However, Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen were not too tired. One stood and caused counter injuries, and the other summoned a large number of bones to attack. One was more relaxed than the other. This is also part of our advantage. Zhao Yuan walked to the next area, at most it's just two or three days without sleep, which can save a lot of time. You want us to lose the bet. I want this Huang Xian to lift a stone and shoot himself in the foot. The two walked for an hour. The dungeon has a large area, and some super large dungeons even take several hours to reach the next stage. After the level is improved, the mount function is unlocked, and the time spent on the journey can be greatly shortened. The scene changed from a rocky forest to a cellar lined with stone pillars. Zhao Yuan saw a strange creature. With a human body, the mouth is completely torn apart, opening like a piranha, with a few greasy tentacles protruding from the inside. Senior Blood Slave Quality, Ordinary, Level, LV9, Skill, Swiftness, Introduction, Civilians transformed into high-level blood slaves by blood clans have extremely fast action methods and can launch attacks in a short time. This is definitely a vampire, why do I feel like a zombie? Zhao Yuan directly taunted with a drawn knife, and rushed to the pile of senior vampires. Instantly killed a group of enemies, and the charge damage of drawing a knife and taunting is also very high, after all, it is an SSS level skill. At the same time, all the senior blood slaves within 150 meters were ridiculed by Zhao Yuan for 10 seconds. These high-level blood slaves landed on all fours and rushed towards Zhao Yuan like wild beasts. A large number of attacks rained down, all of which turned into anti-armor reflection damage, instantly killing a large number of enemies. Zhang Wen waved the white paper lantern, and 350 level 8 bone crows flew into the air, collectively using their sprint skills, they pierced through a large number of enemies in an instant. However, the level 9 high level blood slaves are very powerful, and the bone crow is constantly being destroyed. Zhang Wen then summoned the corpses of the high level blood slaves as his summons. Huang Xian's team was sleeping and resting, while Zhao Yuan directly started the third stage, a mindless progress. Some high-ranking blood slaves also wanted to attack Zhang Wen behind Zhao Yuan, but Zhao Yuan's saber-drawn taunt was cooled down in a few tens of seconds, and he continued to taunt. The high-level blood slaves couldn't beat Zhao Yuan at all, 
and at the same time Zhang Wen also manipulated more than a dozen bones of high-level blood slaves to surround him to protect himself. After all, Zhang Wen was attacked by a man in black with a bow and arrow before, so he didn't dare to be careless. More than 300 bone creatures formed a human wall, blocking Zhao Yuan's back, and it was impossible for a high-level blood slave to rush over. Zhang Wen leisurely flipped through the information of the system mall and chat channels. The number of monsters in a 10-player dungeon requires 10 players to fight for 4 or 5 days, and most of the monsters in this dungeon are of the type with high attack and low defense. It's tricky for other players, but for Zhao Yuan, this type of monster just fits his SSS level anti-armor, and a large number of monsters are killed by the reflection of real damage, which becomes Zhao Yuan's experience value and skill proficiency. 7K Wen Gua Even if Zhang Wen controlled the output of 350 bone creatures, it was still less than 1% of Zhao Yuan's. System Players kill high-level blood slaves, gain 135 experience points, gain 142 experience points. Trigger the talent, billions of times proficiency, and the acquisition multiple will be increased to 3.8 times. SSS level anti-armor gains 7,592 points of skill proficiency asterisk 3.8 times upgrade to LV23. SSS level sword drawing taunts gain 2,361 skill proficiency points asterisk 3.8 times upgrade to LV19. Zhao Yuan's experience value will reach level 8 soon, and he saw several tall creatures among the monster piles. Common blood. Quality. Elite. Level. LV9. Skills. Pierce. Drain. Introduction. The civilians who have been transformed by the blood of the blood family have terrible agility and strength, and their sharp claws can easily penetrate the armor. These ordinary blood races seem to have good intelligence and are no longer ugly, just like normal people's facial features, but their complexion is extremely pale. Zhao Yuan saw the four ordinary blood races bowing their heads to communicate, and then climbed up the towering stone pillars around and attacked Zhang Wen behind Zhao Yuan. Puncture. The four ordinary blood races sprinted to Zhang Wen's side instantly, Zhao Yuan immediately turned on his sword and taunted, bumped into the four enemies, and pulled them into a taunting state. The attacks of the four elite monsters are extremely sharp and fast. For Zhao Yuan, his favorite is the fast attacking enemy, which means that he can deal multiple counter damages in one second. Puff Puff the claws of the four vampires pierced Zhao Yuan frantically, and the terrifying true damage instantly cleared the enemy's health bar, which raised him to level 8. It's just that the elite monsters have such a high level of intelligence, not to mention the final boost, I even want you to enter the final level yourself, I'm in danger of dying. Zhang Wen said. Anyway, you don't lack output. The higher the attack of the booster, the higher the damage of the counter injury. Zhao Yuan's body was flowing with upgraded golden light, and all attributes were improved. System. Kill ordinary blood race asterisk 4, get a piece of white equipment. My god, finally dropped the second piece of equipment. Zhao Yuan sighed and taunted with his drawn knife, and rushed back to the monster pile. Even if Zhao Yuan doesn't wear armor, he still has a layer of illusory thorn armor, which is the passive display effect of SSS level anti-armor. Iron armor. Quality. White. Wear level. LV7. Effect. Defense plus 4, HP plus 5 0. Introduction. Rough armor forged with pig iron. Although the craftsmanship is low, it can barely be called armor. These days, it is good to have equipment, who dislikes rough craftsmanship. Even Zhao Yuan only had two pieces of white equipment, and the other players basically used half scrap equipment. Only elite quality creatures can drop equipment, while ordinary quality monsters can only drop copper coins. Zhao Yuan wore the white iron armor on his body, and the improvement was not great, because the SSS level anti-armor provided a terrifying defense value. But with the armor blocking it, the covered body will not feel pain until the durability is zero. Name. Zhao Yuan. Level. LV8. Talent. Eternal blessing, unique, all skills will remain at SSS level. Hundreds of millions of times of proficiency, unique, the skill will cancel the level cap, and can be upgraded without limit. Killing the target will continuously accumulate the proficiency acquisition multiple, current proficiency multiple, 3.8 times. Cornerstone ability. 
Anti-Armor LV-23 SSS level passively provides high physical defense and magic defense. When suffering damage, it reflects real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacker. Skill. Draw a knife to taunt LV-19 SSS level passively increase the monster's hatred value. After the active release, charge forward for a distance and apply a taunting effect to the enemy 200 meters away for 15 seconds. Backpack. Oak shield white iron armor white. Copper coins. 21,005 pieces. The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. Chapter 11. A full six hours have passed, all the monsters in the third stage have been killed, dozens of elite monsters have appeared, and a piece of white equipment has dropped again. Burlap robe. Quality. White. Wear level. LV7. Effect. Magic value plus 3O, hit plus 3. Introduction. A robe that can barely keep warm, is not conducive to limb stretching, but no one will care. This white coarse cloth robe was naturally equipped by Zhang Wen. Zhao Yuan's experience value reached 60% of level 8, and Zhang Wen reached 86% of level 7. Each level requires too much experience, and normal players may not be able to reach level 10 in 3 months. It took Zhao Yuan less than 2 days to kill more than 30,000 monsters, and this achieved the super speed upgrade. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen were already too sleepy, so they used the tents purchased in the system store, set up them on the spot, and then went to bed and rested. My bone creatures don't need to rest, let them stand guard and feel full of security. Zhang Wen can now summon more than 450 bone creatures, and among them there are dozens of level 9 ordinary blood races, that is, the bones of elite monsters. Like soldiers, they surrounded the two tents, and Zhao Yuan rushed to Zhang Wen's side with a taunt. Zhao Yuan set an alarm clock for three hours before going to bed, then flipped through the chat channel and found that Huang Xian's team had already started the third phase of the strategy. Huang Xian. Brothers, I have tried many times in this third stage. The monsters here are all tree spirits, and there will be elite monsters, but there are three powerful fire-type mages in my team. And I also bought a lot of Molotov cocktails and oil in advance, and I was able to conquer the third stage in less than seven hours. Huang Xian's speech completely calmed the hearts of the players of No. 403 Novice Village. The players of No. 401 Novice Village have given up their resistance. The difficulty of the dungeon is too high. If you continue to fight, even the remaining masters will die. Isn't this item too cool to bet against? Is it really available in the Novice Village? Number 401 Novice Village Player. I envy the people of number 403 Novice Village, I don't want to be weakened. Originally, it was difficult to fight wild monsters. After being punished, I don't know how long it will take to get out of the Novice Village. Let's not talk about the penalty of lowering the attributes. After the difficulty of monster attacking the village increases, all of them have to die under the impact of monsters, whether it is us or NPC. There were three level 10 Lord creatures in the previous monster attack, each of which was killed by the lives of a large number of players and NPCs. If there is one more level 10 Lord creature, then there is no need to fight, just sit and wait to die. Huang Xian, we didn't provoke you, and the random bet target can be selected to know. 401 Novice Village. Zhao Yuan fell asleep. Three hours later, the alarm clock rang, and the two quickly put away the tent and went to the final level. Zhang Wen manipulated the bone creature and carried the two on his back, which was equivalent to a normal speed mount. Although it was bumpy, it was still very comfortable without having to walk by himself. In the third stage of the monster farming process, Zhao Yuan's SSS level anti-armor was finally raised to level 25, his taunting with a knife was level 23, and the multiplier for acquiring skill proficiency was also increased to 4.0 times. That is, Zhao Yuan can actually gain 4 points of proficiency for every 1 point of skill proficiency. Half an hour later, Zhao Yuan saw a ruined and collapsed castle. Just as Zhao Yuan stepped into it, the gate of the castle was completely blocked. The final stage is open, you cannot quit halfway. In the main hall of the castle, a gorgeously dressed male noble was sleeping. It is dressed in the costumes of the Western European palace era, with three-dimensional features, deep outlines, and two extremely obvious white fangs. Blood Baron. Quality. Lord. Level. LV10. Skills. Bat Clone. Shackles of Hell. Vampire. Introduction. 
the blood baron who was seriously injured has been hiding in the village to recover himself. He is afraid of the sun and has terrible fighting power in the dark. Zhang Wen, you retreat to the most edge position, this booze probably will be difficult to break through my defense, you just need to protect yourself. Zhao Yuan said cautiously. I let the bone creatures form a human wall, and the position of the booze is blocked. Huang Xian's team is still in the third stage. As long as we can kill the booze, we can get a lot of rewards. Zhang Wen asked more than a dozen elite creatures to protect the bones, around yourself. At the same time control a large number of bone creatures to surround booze. Be careful of the sneak attack of the man in black, he is probably an elite monster. After Zhao Yuan finished speaking, he immediately started drawing his sword to taunt, and rushed to the blood baron's face. The baron opened his eyes, which were blood red, and the pupils stood up like beasts. Two bedbugs, disturb my slumber, I will make you my blood slaves forever. The blood bars above the blood baron's head appeared, and there were actually three. This shows that the blood baron will have three forms, and every time he loses a tube of blood, his attributes will be improved. Shackles of Hell A large number of black chains protruded from the ground under Zhao Yuan's feet, binding Zhao Yuan's limbs. The blood baron's nails were extremely sharp, as if they were steel, reflecting a shocking cold light. Blood Sucking Clank The blood baron's sharp claws turned into afterimages, and he attacked five times in an instant. Zhao Yuan's blood volume declined for the first time. In this round of attack, Zhao Yuan lost 3% of his HP, which shows that the attack of the Lord Creature is enough to break through Zhao Yuan's defense. And the Blood Baron is a typical creature with high attack and low defense, but it has blood-sucking ability, which can make up for its deficiencies in defense. In an instant, the illusory armor of thorns on Zhao Yuan's body emerged, and five shocking wounds appeared on the Blood Baron's body. The blood bar of the first tube lost one-third directly. This is the value of the Blood Baron after sucking the blood. One can imagine how terrifying Zhao Yuan's SSS level anti-armor is. Bug, how could you have such a terrible injury? This is, a counter injury. The Blood Baron is not low in wisdom. It has survived for a hundred years and understood the situation in an instant. Hey, it's a mere retaliation. I won't attack you. I'll just turn your teammates into blood slaves. Zhang Wen felt the breath of death, and quickly manipulated the bone creature to get stuck in Boo's body. Bat Clone The Blood Baron directly turned into a group of palm-sized bats, passed the bone creature and Zhao Yuan, and flew towards Zhang Wen. Draw a knife and mock. Zhao Yuan directly taunts all enemies within 200 meters, and the Blood Baron can only attack Zhao Yuan forcibly. Sarcasm plus retaliation even if Booz has wisdom, he can't get rid of the ending of being penetrated by real damage. Zhao Yuan directly taunted all the bat clones, interrupting Booz's skills, and Zhang Wen also controlled a level 9 bone creature to attack Booz frantically. Retaliate, 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 7k Wen Gua. The first blood bar of the Booz is directly emptied, because the attack of the Booz is too high, and the value of the counter injury also increases accordingly. Zhao Yuan himself lost 5% of his HP again, and he is still in a very healthy state. The Vampire Baron fell into an invulnerable state, his figure became huge, and the characteristics of the vampire were more exposed. A pair of bat wings protruded from the back, pierced through its expensive and gorgeous dress, the face became hideous and ugly, and the muscles gradually swelled. 7K Wen Gua. Second Form Zhang Wen found that the attack power of his summoned creatures was too low, and it was not as good as Booz's blood-sucking recovery. He manipulated the bone creature to hug Booz's legs, restricting its movement, but Booz was already flying in midair. Draw a knife and mock. The SSS level sword drawing taunt cools down very quickly. After the level is raised, it can even be seamlessly taunted, so that a wide range of enemies can be taunted by him all the time. The second form of the booze attacked Zhao Yuan frantically, especially the attack speed, which was qualitatively improved. Zhao Yuan could only see the scarlet claw marks, and his blood volume declined. Puff Puff, the counter injury effect, which is converted into real damage, directly halves the health bar of the booster. The Baron in the second form has higher attack power and faster attack speed, and the counter injury effect is even more outrageous. To the despair of the Baron, he could not bypass Zhao Yuan no matter what, 
the taunt of this bug made it only attack Zhao Yuan without a moment's rest. Zhao Yuan's counter injury directly overwhelmed the Buzi's blood sucking. Three minutes after the second form came out, the blood bar was completely emptied. The third form begins to transform. Zhao Yuan's HP still has 80%, and he is still in a very healthy state. At this time, Huang Xian's team has completed the third stage of the dungeon and is rushing to the final level. In the chat channel, Huang Xian sent a message. Everyone, our team has successfully passed the third stage of the dungeon, and in the end, only the boost battle is left. Okay, the success of the bet will be of great benefit to the entire village. It is said that the last booze of the village dungeon is a war tree man. No, 401 novice village player. Obviously we didn't provoke them, but we bet against us. The strength is not as good as people, and it can only lead to the slow death of the entire village. Is it possible that Huang Xian's team failed to conquer the boost? He died tragically in the dungeon. After the time for gambling runs out, we don't have to accept punishment. Haha, <laughs> a player from No. 403 Novice Village sent a message. Don't dream, since Huang Xian dares to use the gambling order, he must be sure to win. He can definitely kill this boost. In a short time, there will be no Novice Village number 401 in the world. Although the players in the Novice Village number 401 were angry, they had no choice but to continue to upgrade and deal with the next monster attack. The third form of the Blood Baron awakened, it completely lost its human shape and turned into a bloated and ugly creature. The well-crafted dress was almost torn apart, revealing the blue-black muscles. Boom! Zhao Yuan was knocked flying by the Baron in an instant, and the huge size made all the Baron's attributes take a huge leap. But the Blood Clan Baron in this form has very low sanity, ignores Zhang Wen, and wants to kill Zhao Yuan, even if he doesn't taunt with a drawn sword. But this is exactly what Zhao Yuan wants to see, the higher the attack of the booster, the higher the damage of the counter injury, which is perfect. Puff puff, the Blood Baron's attack sent Zhao Yuan flying, but his blood volume was only reduced by 10%, and the Blood Baron had huge scars, and the blood bar was instantly reduced by one third. Nice. Zhao Yuan's HP is still over 60%, enough to kill Booze. Zhang Wen thought excitedly. The damage output of Zhao Yuan alone is several times higher than that of 10 people. It will take 5 or 6 hours for a team of 10 to fight the final boost, because the blood volume is too thick. If one is not careful, the number of people will be reduced. As soon as the front row dies, the group will be destroyed and Zhao Yuan's SSS level anti-armor is based on the attacking party's attack attribute, and converts it into real damage for reflection. This passive skill gets better and better the more you think about it. It's only been 10 minutes, and the Blood Baron's third blood bar is about to be emptied by retaliation. At this moment, a man in black rushed out from the corner, and it quickly shot an arrow towards Zhang Wen. Don't worry about me, I've been waiting for it. Zhang Wen said through his teammate's voice. You just need to resist the Blood Baron, this man in black, I can handle it myself. Zhang Wen manipulated the skeletons of the elite monsters around him to stand in front of him and fill up all the gaps. Three arrows took away the blood bar of a bone. Want to leave? These days have been worrying me, can I let you go? The bone creatures scattered around inherited the swift, skills of the high-level blood slaves, moving very fast, surrounding the man in black, and attacking continuously. The man in black's cloak fell off. He was a man who looked exactly like the village chief, but he had been transformed by a blood race. Low blood race. Quality. Elite. Level. LV10. Skills. Blood sucking. Triple arrow. Introduction. The younger brother of the village chief was transformed into a dirty creature when he fought against the Blood Baron many years ago. The village chief's younger brother approached the Blood Baron and volunteered to become the Baron's nourishment. The Blood Baron gnawed off the upper body of the village chief's younger brother, and his own blood recovered rapidly. Draw a knife and mock. Zhao Yuan made a movement of drawing his knife and hit the face of Booz directly, pulling the Blood Baron into a taunting state. He failed to swallow the rest of the blood body, and only recovered part of the blood. Details. This hand stuck and interrupted the blood recovery. Zhang Wen exclaimed from behind. If the blood volume is fully restored by the boss, it is not certain who will win. Zhao Yuan's blood volume is less than half. Zhang Wen controlled the bone creatures, 
threw himself on Booze crazily, and attacked without hesitation. Although the damage was not high, the victory was due to the large number of bone creatures. A large number of bone creatures were smashed into pieces by the Blood Baron. The cooldown of Zhao Yuan's sword drawing taunt was restored again, and he rushed to the boss's face, causing huge damage while forcing the taunt. Puff puff, bone deep wounds appeared on Booze, and another five minutes passed. The Blood Baron's blood bar was finally completely emptied, the Baron collapsed powerlessly, and Zhao Yuan's health was only 35% left. It took only 13 minutes for the whole process of attacking Booze, which is the amount of blood that needs a team of 10 people to grind for 5 or 6 hours to kill. Boom! Dazzling golden light enveloped the two of them, Zhao Yuan was promoted to level 9, and Zhang Wen was promoted to level 8. Regional Announcement the bet is over, Shinsho village number 401 is the first to pass the village dungeon, and the bet is successful. Regional announcement. The bet is over, Shinsho village number 401 is the first to pass the village dungeon, and the bet is successful. The members of Huang Xian's team who were fighting the booze battle were dumbfounded, what's going on? We haven't killed the booze yet. Why is the bet over? This is, novice village number, 401. We lost. The team members were dumbfounded, their psychological defense completely collapsed. If it wasn't for the fact that Booze's attack would kill in seconds, these players would have given up. Stay safe, everyone, kill Booze first. Otherwise we will all die here, punishment is better than death. Huang Xian's face was gloomy, but he could only urge his teammates to kill Booze as soon as possible. Didn't Shinsho Village 401 give up? What happened? In the next second, the huge war tree man waved a branch and swept towards Huang Xian. The chat channel was completely boiling. The players in novice village number 403 saw that their side had failed the bet, and cursed in the chat channel. All go, why did we lose? Isn't this unreasonable? Obviously, Huang Xian's team will successfully open up Wasteland. Could it be that there is still a team secretly reclaiming land in novice village 401? It's a mess this time. The punishment for losing the game is not a joke. This Huang Xian, what kind of gambling order did you start? Let's accept the punishment together. Player 401 was even more confused. The strongest team had already chosen to give up, and even got stuck in the second stage, and two players died. Why did the bet suddenly succeed? Could it be that there is really a dungeon in Shinsho village number 401 where the boss is secretly opening up wasteland? No, the village head will only choose the strongest team to join. The village head obviously chooses the team from the three major organizations. Regional Announcement The result of the bet is announced. All attributes of players in Shinsho Village 401 will be increased by 5 points, regional resources will be doubled, and the difficulty of monsters attacking the village will be reduced. Number 403 Novice Village Players All attributes will be reduced by 5 points, regional resources will be halved, and the difficulty of monster attacking the village will increase. Huang Xian, as the sponsor of the bet, failed the bet, all attributes were reduced by 10 points, and experience points were reduced by 9,000 points. In an instant, all attributes of the players in novice village number 401 increased by 5 points, while novice village number 403 wailed, and all attributes decreased by 5 points, which is equivalent to directly depriving the first level of attributes. Zhao Yuan in the dungeon also received his own system prompt. System. As the first team member to clear the village dungeon and win the bet, all attributes will increase by 10 points. As the team leader, get a special reward, Sapphire Lotus Platform White Magic Weapon. Zhang Wen also received a bonus of 10 points for all attributes, which is equivalent to adding two levels of attribute points out of thin air. Up to level 8 in these three days, it won't be too exciting to hang out with you. Zhang Wen said excitedly. I have too many system information prompts here, wait until I read them. Zhao Yuan is already at level 9, and there is only one level left before he can choose one of the three cornerstone talents. An SSS level anti-armor allows him to single-handedly brush the dungeon, and the new cornerstone talent will make a qualitative change in his strength. System. The player kills the 10th level Lord Creature. Blood Baron, and obtains 4,563 experience points, one silver coin, and two pieces of green equipment. The player's personal level is raised to level 9, all attributes plus 5. Trigger the talent, 
billion times proficiency, the current acquisition multiplier is 4.3 times. SSS level anti-armor gains 7,653 points of proficiency asterisk 4.3 times raised to LV27. The SSS level knife drawing taunt gains 2,365 proficiency points asterisk 4.3 times raised to LV23. The player has unlocked the magic weapon function in advance, please check it yourself. After Zhao Yuan checked and killed the Blood Baron, he got two pieces of green equipment, which can be said to be a big hit. Bronze Boots. Quality. Green. Wearing Requirements. LV5. Attributes. Dexterity plus 5, Dodge plus 3. Introduction. Boots engraved with bronze patterns, suitable for close combat under the premise of comfort. Bronze Staff. Quality. Green. Wearing Requirements. LV5. Attributes. Intelligence plus 5, Magic Points plus 150, Magic Recovery plus 1. Introduction. The Bronze Staff can effectively transmit magic power, and can also be used as a hard weapon to smash enemies. Obviously, Zhao Yuan didn't need the staff, so he gave it to Zhang Wen directly. The Bronze Boots were equipped by Zhao Yuan, and he already had three pieces of equipment all over his body. System. The dungeon is being settled. Time spent. 26 hours, number of participants, 2, final score, SSS level. The team gets the SSS level customs clearance gift box. The monsters in the dungeon will hardly drop any rewards, except that the final booze will drop equipment, and the killing rewards of the entire dungeon will be issued at the end, including copper coins, props, gems. After Zhang Wen put on the bronze staff, he opened the gift box for the SSS level clearance. Open the gift box. Get 5 W copper coins, 1st level enhancement stones 10, 1st level gems 3, and 1 piece of green equipment. Enhancement stones can be used to strengthen equipment, but Zhao Yuan has not yet opened the forging function. Gems can be inlaid on equipment to improve attributes, but you need to open the gem slot for the equipment. The green equipment is bronze bracers, which increases attack and defense attributes, and is equipped by Zhao Yuan. 7K Wen Gua now Zhao Yuan's properties panel is Name Zhao Yuan Level LV9 Talent Eternal Blessing Unique All skills will remain at SSS level Hundreds of millions of times of proficiency Unique The skill will cancel the level cap and can be upgraded without restrictions Killing the target will continuously accumulate the multiplier of the proficiency Current proficiency multiplier 4.3 times Cornerstone Ability Anti-Armor LV27 SSS level passively provides high physical defense and magic defense. When suffering damage, it reflects real damage according to the strength attribute of the attacker. Skill. Draw a knife to taunt LV23 SSS level passively increase the monster's hatred value. After the active release, charge forward for a certain distance and apply a taunting effect to the enemy 250 meters away for 15 seconds. Backpack. Oak Shield White Iron Armor White Bronze Boots Green Bronze Bracers Green Level 1 Enhancement Stone 10 Level 1 Gem 3 Copper Coins 7 W Pieces Silver Coin 1 Magic Weapon Green Jade Lotus Terrace The rest of the panels are not yet unlocked. The four pieces of equipment have significantly improved Zhao Yuan's basic attributes, but more importantly, the trigger of the hundreds of thousands of multipliers talent has reached 4.3 times. With this talent, Zhao Yuan's SSS level skills can be quickly upgraded, and the two unique talents are the foundation of his strength. The magic weapon function was originally unlocked at level 20, but Zhao Yuan, as the leader of the successful gambling team, received a special reward and unlocked the magic weapon function in advance. Green Jade Lotus Terrace. Quality. White. Level. LV1. Upgradable. Attributes. HP plus 300, HP plus 5, Defense plus 20. Special Effect. After turning it on, restore a small amount of your own health, lasting 15 seconds, with a cooling time of 1 minute. After equipping the Jade Lotus platform, a fist-sized magic weapon floats around Zhao Yuan, which will follow the player. Just a white magic weapon, the panel attributes provided are ridiculously high, and this is still a level 1 attribute. Magic weapons can be constantly upgraded by spending copper coins to strengthen their attributes and special effects. 
In the later stage, the attributes provided by a powerful magic weapon are higher than those provided by two or three pieces of equipment, not to mention the active special effects of the magic weapon. Zhang Wen used the S-level bone summoning and used the corpse of the Blood Baron as the sacrificial material, and obtained the bone of a level 10 Lord creature. Although only 50% of the attributes were inherited, the skills were inherited. This is the correct way to open the S-level bone summoning. After killing the booze, you can get the booze bones, which can always be stored in the summoning space. Zhang Wen said excitedly. However, the bone creature cannot be resurrected, and it disappears completely after the blood bar is emptied. Zhao Yuan opened his magic weapon panel, and the cost of upgrading a magic weapon was 1000 coins. He upgraded frantically, and copper coins only made sense if they were converted into combat power. Spend 1000 copper coins to raise the magic weapon level to LV1. Spend 5000 copper coins to raise the magic weapon level to LV2. Spend 1 W copper coins. Spend 2 W copper coins. Spend 3 W copper coins. Insufficient copper coins. The upgrade is interrupted, and the magic weapon level is upgraded to LV5. Green Jade Lotus Terrace. Quality. White. Level. LV5. Upgradable. Attributes. HP plus 2000, HP plus 25, Defense plus 100. Special Effect. After opening, restore your own health for 15 seconds, with a cooling time of 1 minute. The attributes provided by the level 5 white magic weapon completely overwhelmed white equipment, even green equipment. But the magic weapon is basically impossible to drop, and it is only possible to obtain it in the final level of the super large copy and large scale events. Therefore, many players in the 4th and 5th ranks only have a white and green magic weapon. This level 5 white magic weapon directly made Zhao Yuan the player with the highest HP in the entire novice village. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen chose to quit the dungeon, and a teleportation point appeared at the location of the original Boo's corpse. The two stepped into it and returned to the village chief's hut. World Announcement The world record of the LV10 village copy has been refreshed, and the current record is an SSS rating. World Announcement LV10 village copy world record Sure enough, it's you. The village chief has been waiting at the teleportation point for a long time, you two killed the Blood Baron. Zhang Wen smiled and said, We not only passed the copy, but also saw your brother, but he has been transformed into a Blood Clan, and has become the nourishment of the Blood Clan Baron. Alas, the village chief sighed, Ten years ago, the Baron of the Blood Clan attacked the village, but the vitality of the Blood Clan is really tenacious, and they sacrificed so many people to be seriously injured. Finally, I finally saw my brother die. The meaning of my existence is to kill my brother who has become an ugly creature with my own hands. Zhao Yuan tried to open his mouth and said, Village chief, the monster attack on the village is coming, is there anything we need to do? The village chief responded, of course, there is a serious shortage of arrows, spears, black oil, and logs for strengthening the city wall. These are our weights against monsters. System. The player has accepted the tasks. Collect black oil, collect logs, collect bones, and the final reward will be determined by the completion of the task. This was already the third day after Zhao Yuan became a player. He desperately wanted to level up to level 10 but even the high experience gained after killing the boosters only allowed him to reach 5% of level 9. After you reach level 10, you can unlock the forging function, you can strengthen equipment, inlay gems, and most importantly, you can choose the second cornerstone talent. The world announcement about Zhao Yuan's refresh of a level 10 village dungeon with an SSS rating has been swiped three times in a row. Players in No. 401 Novice Village and No. 403 Novice Village have no doubts that the mysterious team hidden in No. 401 Novice Village has completed the SSS grade. Because the time points overlapped, Huang Xian's face was gloomy at this time. Although he finally completed the killing of the booster, three members died when the attributes were permanently weakened. As the initiator of the gambling order, he was punished and his attributes were reduced by 10 points. He has faded from the position of the first class master, and now the players in No. 403 Novice Village have swiped the screen to abuse him. You, do your own sin, don't live. Huang Xian harms others, kills his teammates, and reduces his attributes. It's also implicated our other players. 
K. When someone initiates a gambling order, and the bet is about to succeed, you are the happiest to lick it, right? K. In the doomsday game, everything is based on success or failure. He Huang Xian is not obsessed with ghosts. Isn't it so much trouble to use the gambling order? The players in No. 401 Novice Village were about to jump with excitement. My god, I was ready to be punished, but it turned out that we won. Could it be that there are still big bosses hidden in this small novice village? Everyone has seen the world announcement just now. This time point is too coincident. The high probability is that our no. 401 novice village players successfully passed the village dungeon and received an SSSS rating. Don't say it's SSS, even if it's an A-level clearance evaluation, it's already a big boss among the big guys. It makes me worship from the bottom of my heart. There is an SSS level clearance evaluation. I'm stupid. The people of the three major organizations also had mixed feelings. They thought that Sean Gui, Wahoo, and Meilan were already the ceiling of No. 401 Novice Village. As a result, there were characters who could get SSSS level clearance evaluation. Fujun murmured, No, it can't be him, right? The captain of the Fujun asked, He. Which one? What do you know? Fu Jun's face was embarrassed, I have met a player who is likely to be a SS level cornerstone talent. You may not believe it. I plan to kill him at first. Teammate, when the players of No. 401 novice village hunted monsters in the wilderness, they also found the benefit of doubling resources. After doubling the resource reward, the frequency of medicinal materials, wood, stones, and random treasure chests in the wild has become more frequent. This is too cool, right? The original task of collecting medicinal materials took 5 hours, but now it can be completed in 3 hours. Wait for me. Zhang Wen looked at the map, black oil is obviously the most important material. It can burn monsters, and it can only appear in level 10 wild areas. The materials of arrows and spears are replaced by the bones of beasts. The more advanced the bones, the better the props produced. It's decided, just go to this area. Zhao Yuan pointed to the level 10 area at the very edge of the map. Zhao Yuan said casually, Let's go, now the fighting strength of the two of us can almost lie flat on the level 10 wilderness. Even if there will be a wild lord, we can try to kill it. The two stepped into the teleportation point at the same time, and Zhang Wen chose the most edge of the known map. After the light in front of him was restored, Zhao Yuan had already appeared above the wilderness, and a barren and dangerous atmosphere permeated the entire area. Zhang Wen waved the bronze staff, and all the bone creatures in the summoning space appeared, a total of 246 bones of level 9 blood slaves, who inherited the swift skill. The other bone creatures were all shattered when they fought against the blood baron. The most important one was Zhang Wen who summoned the bones of the blood baron. The appearance of this 10th level lord creature is not much different from that of ordinary bone creatures, but a pair of bat wings formed by patchwork of white bones are pierced on the back. The three skills of the blood baron are all inherited by the bone creature. As far as the eye can see, a level 10 monster of ordinary quality found the two of them. Zhang Wen controlled his own bone army to attack the surrounding monsters. In the doomsday game, the full attributes of wild creatures under the night will be doubled, and occasionally there will be a blood moon, and the full attributes of wild creatures will be doubled. Zhang Wen easily controlled the bone creature to attack, leaving only 10 level 10 elite creatures to protect him. The key is that the appearance of the blood moon is irregular. Even for the two of us, it is difficult to farm monsters and upgrade in the wild under the dark night. There's a disproportionate amount of effort and effort, and we need sleep to recharge. Red Spotted Mushroom. Quality. Ordinary. Level. LV10. Skill. Poison Gas. Introduction. A creature formed from the mutation of the Red Spotted Poisonous Mushroom. It has human limbs, and its bright appearance corresponds to its deadly toxin. Mushrooms that can walk are a bit disgusting. Zhao Yuan started drawing his sword to taunt, directly crashing into the crowd of monsters, and forced all the monsters to taunt. There was a gap in the red spot on the top of the mushroom monster's head, and a thick green poisonous gas spewed out. 7K Wen Gua. Zhao Yuan was immediately covered by the poisonous gas, but his defense value was too high, and the poisonous gas buff couldn't knock out even a bit of his blood. Instead, 
it was the continuous counter injury triggered by the poisonous gas, which continuously empty the blood bars of these mushroom monsters. The poisonous gas is triggered once a second, which is equivalent to reversing real damage once a second. These level 10 ordinary monsters couldn't hold on for even 8 seconds and fell to the ground one after another. Regional announcement. A catastrophic event has occurred. 401 to 500 novice village monster attack time is shortened, it will start in 24 hours. Regional announcement. A catastrophic event has occurred. 401 to 500 novice village monster attack time is shortened, it will start in 24 hours. Catastrophic event. Zhao Yuan frowned, in 24 hours, it is impossible for us to reach level 10. There are expansion packs of natural disasters, animal disasters, and alien invasions in the Doomsday game. Larger human cities will be randomly destroyed by natural disasters, and will also be attacked by monsters of a terrifying scale. The most horrific and most echoing theme of Doomsday is alien invasion, that is, players from other civilizations invade the plane, and players from different civilizations compete with each other. Let's hurry up and collect materials that are useful for defending the village. Zhao Yuan carried the attacks of hundreds of mushroom monsters and kept moving forward, with corpses constantly falling down. Although the Blood Baron Bone controlled by Zhang Wen has only 50% attributes, it can easily kill these level 10 ordinary monsters in seconds. Ignoring a large number of monsters, the two continued to move forward. After an hour, Zhao Yuan saw an oil field. Black oil is gushing out from the wellhead, but this area is already in the foggy area. Not on the map of Shinsho village, black oil field, this is a strategic material point. If it can be collected completely and transported back, it will definitely be a big killer against monsters attacking the village. And around these black oil fields, there are a large number of level 13 monsters, porcupines with black skin, huge in size, trampling near the oil fields. Black Mountain Porcupine. Quality. Ordinary. Level. LV13. Skills. Fangs. Charge. Introduction. Wild boars with hard tusks and thick skin can easily kill creatures that intrude on their territory. Charge plus fangs, it seems that the attributes are not low. Although it is a 13th level monster, it can only be my experience value. Zhao Yuan opened the taunt with his knife and slammed into the oil field. Dozens of nearby Haishan porcupines charged and hit Zhao Yuan with their sharp tusks, but he was not injured, but a group of porcupines, who were left with a lot of scars by the counter-injury effect. Zhao Yuan stood near the black oil supply point and got a system prompt. Strategic material point, it takes 12 hours after occupation to fully exploit black oil. It's okay, 12 hours, hurry up and return to the village before night. Zhao Yuan directly chose to occupy the material point. Generally, players choose to kill all the nearby monsters before they can occupy and mine with peace of mind, but Zhao Yuan directly stood on the material point without a brain. All the porcupines that attacked him were killed by the anti-damage effect. Pieces of corpses fell down and were collected by the backpack that came with the mission. Porcupine horns can also be used as materials for arrows and spears, and wild boar can also be made into food. A steady stream of Montenegrin porcupines rushed towards Zhao Yuan, but they became corpses one after another, and Zhao Yuan didn't even need to start drawing a knife to taunt. These Montenegrin porcupines will actively attack creatures occupying resource points. Zhang Wen also brushed it very well, and gradually replaced the bone creatures with the bones of a level 13 porcupine, which was stronger. Successful occupation of material points, mining progress, 1%, 100%. The progress bar in front of Zhao Yuan is extremely slow, and it will take 12 hours to fully mine successfully. But the two of them are very easy to brush monsters, and the experience value provided by level 13 monsters is not low. Battle tip. Kill the 13th level Montenegrin porcupine, get 213 experience points, and get 5 copper coins. Trigger talent. Hundreds of millions of times proficiency, the current acquisition multiple has been increased to 4.5 times. SS's level anti-armor gains 5,632 proficiency points asterisk 4.5 times and the level is increased to LV30. The SSS level sword drawing taunt gains 2,362 proficiency points asterisk 4.5 times and the level is increased to LV25. Zhang Wen is still stuck at level 8, and the improvement is very slow. 
the magic power enhancement of S level and the summoning level of bones have been improved. Zhang Wen has been able to summon 650 white-boned creatures, and more than 600 white-boned wild boars formed a neat army, and launched a charge at the same time. The scene was very spectacular. A player in novice village number 401 opened his friend list and selected a person named, Tujun, to send a message. In the world announcement, players who have completed the SSS rating of the village copy are in our number. 401 Novice Village. After a few minutes passed, the other party replied, Oh. Are you sure? It's confirmed that our two villages have wagered on which side will pass the village copy first. The result just showed that the bet was successful, and the world announcement will come out in the next second, which means that the players of No. 401 Novice Village have completed the SSS grade. Very good. Tujun sent a message. I need his specific information. As a reward, I will give you 20 W copper coins, 10 first level enhancement stones, and a piece of green equipment. If you get the detailed information on the player who completed the SSS level dungeon, then I will pay you 100 times the resources. The most important thing for me is integrity. If you deceive me with false information, you will know what will happen. If your information is true, and you get his name and coordinates, even if you become a player of our Sakura Kingdom, I can help you do it. Takuma said with a smile. Don't worry, at this point, I have no way out, there is only one way to the end. A player in Novice Village 401 ended the call, used the resources sent by mail to strengthen himself, and then hid himself among the players. Except for Shinsho Village number 401, the other 100 Shinsho villages were all in panic. The catastrophe caused the monsters to attack the village earlier, with only 24 hours left. Originally, there were nearly five days to improve his strength and complete the task, but now, he could only bite the bullet. As for Shinsho village number 403, where the bet failed, it was miserable. All attributes of all players are reduced by five points, resources are halved, and the difficulty of monsters attacking the stronghold is increased, and there are less than 24 hours left. I'm going to Huang Xi'an, let's just kill myself, now all of us who have been killed will be buried with you. Where are you hiding now? Aren't you a B-level cornerstone talent? I see that after 24 hours, we can't hold it at all. More than 80% of the players will die here. Brothers still have time to complain here, hurry up and collect materials, strengthen the city wall, and raise arrows, there are only less than 24 hours left, if you don't unite, you will really die. I'm just so angry that Huang Xi'an played a good hand like this. That kid failed the bet, and all attributes decreased by 10 points, basically falling from the category of first-rate powerhouses. I think among the 100 novice villages that suffered accidental disasters, number 401 is more comfortable. After all, the difficulty of monsters attacking the village has been reduced. Alas, I can't envy you. In the past six hours, Zhao Yuan's mining progress bar has exceeded 50%, and a steady stream of porcupines rushed into him, and then he was pierced by the SSS level anti armor. Unfortunately, Zhang Wen murmured, These bone creatures cannot be upgraded, they can only maintain the level before death, otherwise, I will have a very high level lord creature. This is only an S level skill, and its strength is already very high. If the bone creature you summon can be upgraded, it is probably an SS level skill. Zhao Yuan used another taunt to draw a knife and a large number of people will be killed during the charge porcupine spike. Dark shackles, blood sucking, bat clone, Zhang Wen controls the bone baron, it's so fun, he has a level 10 booze summoner, plus more than 600 bone boars. Boom, the rich golden light splashed on Zhang Wen, and he finally reached level 9, with an increase of 5 points in all attributes. Upgrading is too slow, our monster spawning efficiency is so terrifying, and leveling up is still so difficult. Ordinary players have to use all their strength to fight a monster of the same level, and there is a risk of injury. Zhao Yuan said helplessly, I've been killing for so long to reach 25% experience points. The porcupine corpse materials were automatically loaded into the system backpack, and the quantity reached 6,000 plus units. Another six hours passed, and Zhao Yuan finally finished collecting the black oil. The collection of resource points is completed, and a total of 7,623 units of black oil have been obtained. During the battle, 
Zhao Yuan kept using the active special effect of the magic weapon. Anyway, it does not consume after it is activated, and it can continue to recover blood within 15 seconds, which is a relatively practical special effect. More importantly, the panel attributes provided by the magic weapon, with more than 2,000 health points, gave Zhao Yuan the possibility to rush into the enemy's pile in the next monster attack. At this time, the sky was gradually turning dark, and the morning glow before the night was faintly visible. The monsters in the wilderness became violent, their pupils were red, and their bodies became larger. Under the dark night, all the attributes of wild creatures are doubled, please be careful to avoid it. There are so many units of black oil, I don't know how much rewards can be exchanged. The village chief should not think about the white wolf with empty gloves. Zhang Wen controlled the white bone legion and returned all the way. And let the corpse of the blood baron carry the two people on his back, and the movement speed is very fast, which is a bit awkward. After killing the violent wild monsters along the way, the two return to the teleportation point. As long as the safe zone is not breached, the teleportation point will always exist. After three seconds of teleportation time, the two return to No. 401 Novice Village. At this time, the atmosphere in the whole village was extremely serious, and the silence before the war was terrifying. After finding the village chief, Zhao Yuan directly handed over 7,000 units of black oil and tens of thousands of porcupine carcasses to the village chief. This is, black oil. So much, the village chief was pleasantly surprised. Put black oil on the road, and it can cause huge damage to monsters when ignited. And the continuous burning effect of black oil is very strong. It's been burning for 10 minutes and it will remain inextinguishable. How did you find these black oils? There is no such resource near our village. Zhao Yuan responded. I didn't before, but after the successful bet, the village's resources doubled, and we found black oil in the foggy, undiscovered area. And the corpses of these tens of thousands of wild boars, can the processing be completed within the remaining ten hours? Of course, the logistics staff in the village will not sleep tonight, and they have to complete the fortifications. The village chief said firmly. Your efficiency is amazing. You deserve to be the ones who cleared the village dungeon. I got some strengthening stones in my early years, and I gave them to you together. Task Reminder The task of collecting fortification materials has been completed, the reward is 6 W copper coins, the first level enhancement stone asterisk 10, and one piece of white equipment. Level 1 enhancement stones can enhance the attributes of equipment after turning on the forging function. Now Zhao Yuan has 20 of them, but the forging function can only be turned on at level 10. Copper coins are hard currency. No matter when, they are urgently needed by players. Even if it is tens of billions of copper coins, when the combat power is strengthened, it will melt in an instant and drop to single digits. The white equipment is a warhammer, Zhao Yuan is just short of a weapon, although his output mainly comes from SSS level anti-armor. Hammer. Quality. White. 7. Wearing requirements. LV5. Attributes. Physical attack plus 5, strength plus 3. Introduction. A heavy hammer with hard spikes that is difficult for the weak to lift. The village chief left in a hurry, I brought the materials and asked the logistics staff to process these materials. We must make full use of these materials before the 11 hour countdown. After that, he rushed to the blacksmith's forge. Zhao Yuan has the copper coins rewarded by the quest, plus the copper coins he picked up by spawning monsters, enough to upgrade the white magic weapon by one level. Zhao Yuan directly smashed more than 7 W copper coins, and the white magic weapon was upgraded to level 6. Green Jade Lotus Terrace. Quality. White. Level. LV6 Upgradable. Attributes. HP plus 2800, HP plus 30, Defense plus 125. Special effect. After opening, restore your own health for 15 seconds, with a cooling time of 1 minute. After the upgrade of the magic weapon, Zhao Yuan's copper coins fell back to more than 1 W. At this time, Zhao Yuan could already see that hundreds of guard NPCs and players were carrying buckets of black oil, which were continuously spread on the ground outside the village, and leaves behind layers of hay. Laying hay can disguise the road as ordinary ground. There are high IQ creatures among the monsters. Simple but effective camouflage does not waste much time.
At the same time, a large number of engineers dug holes outside the village and used the spears formed by grinding the bones of wild animals to make ground thorn traps. Since the walls of the village are made of raw wood, the black oil will also burn the city walls and can only be laid on the area outside the city walls. Although there are many stones in the village, there is no technology that can make the stones form walls, and the materials for making cement cannot be collected in the village. A huge blood-red countdown solidified over the village, and the time was less than 11 hours. Blacksmiths and their apprentices continued to polish the bones of beasts to form spears or arrows, and players in the village are also making their own contributions. Let's go to rest first and keep our spirits up before we can face the monsters attacking the village. Now we can't do anything. Going into the wild at night is totally worth the loss. Zhao Yuan and Zhang Wen walked to an inn, and after paying the copper coins, they could live there. Zhao Yuan saw the children in the shopkeeper's house crying constantly. The shopkeeper looked sad, wondering if he could survive the monster attack. According to the strategy on the forum, there are usually three waves of monsters attacking the village, and there will even be flying creatures and long-range enemies. Zhang Wen looked at the chat channel and said, Of course, the most terrifying nature is the Lord creatures in the last wave, and the monsters usually take more than 24 hours to attack the village, which means. It means that you will encounter beasts with doubled attributes in the dark night. Zhao Yuan took over. But the good news is that my experience value is still 45% short, and I can upgrade to level 10. That is, after the first wave of monsters attacking the stronghold, I will most likely be able to complete the upgrade. After acquiring the new cornerstone talent, the strength has skyrocketed, and even in the dark night, it can resist the attacks of the three lord creatures. Zhang Wen also looked forward to. Also, I can also upgrade to level 10 in the second wave of monsters attacking the stronghold. My current experience value is 5% of level 9. Before facing the lord creature, I can get the second cornerstone talent. And I followed you, the big guy. I cleared the village dungeon with an SSS rating. It's terrible to hide a high score. There is a 100% probability of getting an S level skill. I will try my best to see if I can make a wave of SS level. After the conversation was over, the two returned to their respective rooms. As long as the security zone was not breached, the in-room would be absolutely safe. No one else can enter without their permission. And the three major organizations of NO. 401 Novice Village are already holding meetings to formulate plans to face monsters and attack the village. Wang Muhei, the captain of the Mountain Ghost Organization, was the first to say, although we succeeded in the bet and the difficulty of the monster attacking the village is reduced, we still can't be careless. If you keep it, you can get rich system rewards. If you can't keep it, you may die in the tide of monsters. In my opinion, half of the players in the entire number. 401 Novice Village will die on the battlefield. Quan Yin, the captain of the Mylan organization, shook his head and said. Half, you're thinking too objectively, right? At least two-thirds die. This is a semi-digital world. It is difficult to recover if you lose your arm. Recovering blood can only save your life. A severed limb can only be recovered by more advanced treatment skills. With strong morale and tacit cooperation among the players in the village, we can successfully defend if two-thirds of the players die. The leader of the Flower Tigers added. But who wants to die? Everyone wants to be the part of the players who survived. Have you forgotten that there is still a hidden team in our village that successfully cleared the village dungeon? Perhaps the situation is not as bad as we thought. The one who should panic should be no. 403 Novice Village. Being punished by the gambling order, most of them will be destroyed. Quan Yin of the Milan organization stood up and said, We can't control this hidden team, we can only do our part. I want the command of the three major organizations, and we can only reasonably match all the players, to reduce losses. Hey, you Quan Yin is a commanding genius, in which way did I lose to you? Wang Muhe sneered. Don't you just want to rely on command to get more battlefield points, and finally convert them into rewards? Yes, I don't know about the command. The leader of the Huahu organization put his elbow on the table, the two of you should fight for it, but there is not much time left for you. Whoever obeys and who does not obey, only ours to decide. Also, although I don't know how to command, if someone takes my brother to death and becomes cannon fodder, so that his own people can preserve their strength. 
The captain of the Huahu organization looked directly at the two and said, I don't care what monsters attack the village, let's talk about the person who hacked me to death. No, 401 Novice Village has a total of 5,000 players, plus more than 2,000 NPCs with combat power. Excluding those who have recently died, there are also nearly 7,000 combat power. Among them, there are nearly 700 reserve personnel, and some players have auxiliary skills, such as forging, medicine, engineering. After a night of hard work, these auxiliary personnel transformed all available resources into war killers. The next day, the alarm clock set in advance woke Zhao Yuan up. He went downstairs and spent copper coins to buy food from the inn. Zhang Wen also joined the table, and there was one hour left in the countdown for the monsters to attack the village. Filled with food and drink, filled the hidden value of hunger to more than 90%, and came to the edge of the city wall. The terrain of No. 401 Novice Village is good for defense, surrounded by mountains on both sides and turbulent rivers on one side. There is only one direction for monsters to attack the village, and some novice villages need to block enemies from multiple directions. And no, 401 Novice Village only needs to concentrate manpower and defend the north wall. With one hour left in the countdown, Quan Yin, the leader of the Mylan organization, spoke on the regional channel. Everyone, now I am the temporary commander of number. 401 Novice Village. In order to save lives, everyone obeys my command. Everyone, rest assured, as long as we cooperate reasonably, we can definitely defend the village and reduce casualties. In addition to our successful bet, the monster attack on the stronghold has been reduced, and all players have received attribute rewards. Among the 100 villages that have suffered disaster events, we are definitely the one with the best chance of winning. Although my command ability is not a genius, it is reasonable enough. You must trust me, so that the number of deaths will be reduced in the end. At the same time, I also communicated with the village chief and obtained the command of the village guard. Finally, there are hidden characters in our village who can get through the copy of the village. The time is right and the place is right, and we are not short of it. Zhang Wen said from the side, who is this person? The morale of all the players has been boosted by him. First explain the importance of reasonable cooperation, and then point out the powerful players in the village. Finally, only your own commander can qualify, plus the reward for successful betting. It's all to our advantage, and the enthusiasm of the players has been completely mobilized. Zhao Yuan also nodded and said, the three major organizations finally launched this Quan Yin as the commander, which must have his uniqueness. Otherwise, the three major organizations compete with each other, and no one will obey the other. And a large number of players will definitely die when monsters attack the village. There will always be players who want to fish in the water, don't want to contribute, and go to the end. His remarks will make these players join his team. At least the prelude to this battlefield is correct. In the chat channel, players are also discussing frantically. Who is this person? Quan Yin. Quan Yin is the captain of the Mylan organization. I don't know that. As a commander, I am in a relatively safe position. In addition to getting a lot of battlefield points, this Quan Yin can convince the other two organizations to obey him and follow his command. It seems that he is really capable. Then we will trust him once, everyone will unite, fight off the monsters attacking the village, and finally exchange the battlefield points for rewards. My good fellow, I'm all excited. What Quan Yin said makes sense. We can't hold it, let alone the other 100 villages that suffered from the cataclysmic event. It's over. Regional announcement. The number. 401 novice village monster attack is about to start, and the battlefield points rankings will be opened. The battlefield points can be exchanged for rewards after the catastrophe event ends. Players' kills, assists, commands, and damage will all be converted into battlefield points, and both auxiliary players and combat players can get corresponding points. The chat channel is closed, and the command channel is open during wartime. Ordinary players cannot speak. Players in the top 10 in the rankings have several opportunities to speak, and the commander can speak every 5 minutes. Monster attacking the village is about to strike, players please be careful. Zhao Yuan glanced at the rules and said, players can also get battlefield points for healing their teammates, and shield defense players can also get corresponding points for taking damage. Those guys who build the fortifications, 
also get points when the fortifications work, everyone's on a level playing field. Zhang Wen looked at Quan Yin above the city wall, this guy sits still, he can get a lot of points just by commanding a few words, and he is definitely a strong contender for the top three rankings. However, it is true that there are commanders who are different. A piece of loose sand can't be defended at all. Reasonable use of combat power determines half of the winning rate. Quan Yin glanced at the chat channel before closing, and most people obeyed his orders, even if there were very few people who didn't want to obey his orders. But in the face of death, these people will choose to follow the crowd, and after the effectiveness of their command is shown, almost all players will follow his command. Quan Yin said in the wartime chat channel. After the hard work of the auxiliary staff last night, we covered a lot of black oil on the ground and made a lot of Molotov cocktails. There are 56 ground thorn traps, and they are laid with pure poisonous steel wires. The city walls are also reinforced with stones, the arrows are adequately supplied, and there are also a large stock of medicines for treatment. Time is running out, we can only do this level of defense. Now, all our players will be divided into shield defense teams, treatment teams, long-range output teams, and melee output teams. The shield defense player is at the front, followed by the melee player, and then the healing team. The core members of our three major organizations, including myself, will also be on the front line. Time is running out, let's act quickly. 7,000 combat strength, most of them are level 7 and 8 players, and a few are level 10 players. Although I'm a bit annoyed that Quan Yin is telling me what to do, but he is also at the forefront and he looks okay. Zhang Wen walked into the long-distance output team. Zhao Yuan also joined the shield defense team. He held a white wooden shield in one hand and a long-handled barbed hammer in the other. Time gradually passed, and the countdown finally reached zero. Regional announcement. The monster attack begins. Players are requested to be cautious. If the novice village is breached, the safety zone will lose its protective effect, and the teleportation point will also be invalid. Hey, brother, you have quite a lot of equipment. You've almost got a set together. If you have the ability, please help me. A tall shield player said. It's all white equipment, worthless. Zhao Yuan responded casually, and then saw a dark tide rushing towards the village. It was a terrifying number of beasts, rushing madly, and even many monsters were squeezed and killed the ferocious beast trampled to death. But the speed of the monster tide did not slow down at all. There are more than 60,000 of these just seen. This is just the beginning. Zhao Yuan sent a message to Zhang Wen. 600,000 can't handle your SSS level anti-armor, and there is a healing team behind you, who can reduce your health to 80%. Zhang Wen sent a message from behind. I'm afraid there are only three Lord creatures under the Knight State bonus. This is a real doomsday game. Players will feel severe pain when they are injured, and they will be instantly killed if they are hit in a fatal position and lose their head. Zhao Yuan said. And broken hands and feet can't be recovered only by blood recovery skills, and can only be achieved by relying on advanced healing skills. Commanding such a real war is like commanding an ancient battlefield. It is full of variables, and it is many times more complicated than the battlefield in online games. Zhang Wen also echoed in his friend's private message. It depends on the fact that Quan Yin is no longer capable. This is not as simple as pulling hatred in shield battles in online games, output control damage, and healing players to release skills accurately. Quan Yin stood on the city wall, and the frontline soldiers were exposed at the front. As the monster tide approached, it had completely entered the coverage of the black oil. Don't worry, we have to let all the monsters come in. It's now, Quan Yin spoke in the wartime command channel. The arrow catches the fire. Clank. Dozens of archer players in the rear threw arrows that ignited the arrows. The ground covered in black oil was instantly ignited, and dark green flames rose up, covering most of the monsters. The range of long-range output players is generally around 20 meters. The only way to attack is to wait for the monster to approach. Just now, the dozens of arrows were all equipped with skill effects, so they could be thrown such a long distance. The monsters in the sea of fire screamed horribly, and the player would feel real pain when injured, and the same is true for these monsters. It can be seen that the blood bar of the monster in the sea of flames keeps dropping, and the black oil is stained on the monster's body, which cannot be extinguished no matter what. In the end, these monsters rushed towards the village crazily.
The sea of fire could not stop them, it could only consume the blood of the monsters. As the tide of monsters approached, various traps were triggered, such as ground thorn traps, steel wires with venom. Zhao Yuan's battlefield points are starting to rise now, because he contributed the black oil, and the auxiliary players who laid the traps also gained battlefield points. Quan Un ranked first, and just commanding the team allowed him to gain a lot of battlefield points. In the monster attack, all monsters will not drop rewards, and will be converted into corresponding points. After the monsters attack the stronghold, these points can be exchanged for generous rewards. This also eliminates the possibility of continuously becoming stronger during the battle. Apart from experience points and skill proficiency, these monsters will not provide other rewards. Once the monster fails to attack the stronghold, these points will be invalidated, and it is a question of whether the player can survive. When the tide of monsters approached to only 100 meters, one third of them were killed by traps, and the rest of the monsters were also seriously injured, and there was not a single monster with full blood. Only then did the attributes of the monster appear in everyone's sight. Level 10 Grey Wolf, Level 10 Ape, Level 10 Hyena, Level 10 Spike Monster. The simplest wave of monsters in the first wave were all level 10 monsters of ordinary quality, and the difficulty of the subsequent two waves can be imagined. When the monster was still 50 meters away from the city wall, Quan Un ordered in the wartime command channel. Archery team, launch a long distance projectile. The range of a general archer is only 20 meters, but if the arrow is thrown upwards, the arrow will eventually lose its strength as it rises, and will fall back to the ground under the action of gravity. Although this kind of projectile weakens the power of the arrow, the distance is longer, and the village has a lot of arrows in stock, so it can carry out a projectile cover attack. Hundreds of arrows fell into the tide of monsters, killing many monsters, but most of them continued to attack with arrows stuck in their bodies. Here we come. The collision is imminent. Everyone, get ready, don't let a monster crawl over it, it will seriously disrupt our formation. Quan Yin said. The faces of all the players and NPCs became serious, but at this moment a figure jumped off the city wall and landed outside the village, as if he was about to die. Who is this person? Have you ever seen someone rushing to die? Quan Yin cursed. The other players were also stunned, what's the matter with this guy? Why did he jump off without taking advantage of the city wall's architectural advantages? Did he fall down because of his weak feet? Wait. There is still a boss level player hidden in Novice Village 401, could it be him? The players quickly figured it out. It is impossible for someone not to cherish their own life. This shield defense player has a high probability of clearing the village dungeon and winning the game. That's not right. Even a player who can clear the dungeon, but he only has one person. Could it be that he wants to fight against tens of thousands of level 10 ordinary monsters alone? Where's his teammates? Where's his 10-man squad? I don't understand. The situation on the battlefield didn't give the players much time to think, Zhao Yuan had already collided with the wave of monsters. Holding a hammer, Zhao Yuan started drawing his sword to taunt. With a swift charge, he directly smashed into the pile of monsters, instantly killing a group of monsters. At the same time, he was forced to taunt, and the super-wide range of forced taunt directly stunned everyone. Quan Yin already understood that this person was the hidden strongman in Shinsho village number 401, but it was even more terrifying than he imagined. His thoughts turned, and he commanded, the long-range output team attacks with all its strength. The melee team throws the Molotov cocktail. All of a sudden, arrows, crossbow bolts, fireballs, icicles, and wind blades smashed down from the rear of the team. Zhao Yuan, who has a teammate damage system, will not be accidentally injured by the attack on the city wall. He is like a stone statue, fixed in place. Countless attacks landed on Zhao Yuan's body, but his blood streaks did not move at all. Instead, the blood streaks of the beast closest to him decreased instantly, making it incomprehensible. The passive effect of drawing a knife and taunting can also increase the monster's hatred towards him, so Zhao Yuan blocked the entire wave of monsters by himself, and the eyes of the players behind him almost popped out. What kind of defense is this? The blood streaks don't move at all, and they don't even need the assistance of healing players. One person can resist the attack of tens of thousands of monsters. Quan Yin said incredulously. Look at the illusory thorn armor on his body. It is the display effect of the passive skill anti-armor. 
he just stood there and was attacked, and hundreds of beasts were injured and killed. Wang Muhe said from the side. The most outrageous thing is his taunting skill, right? One third of the monsters are held back by a taunt. These beasts instantly lost interest in us on the city wall, and they can only forcibly attack him alone. Slight twitching, staring blankly for a while. Even the captains of the three major organizations were so shocked, let alone other ordinary players. Zhang Wen released all the bone creatures in the summoning space at once, a total of 800 level 13 wild boar bones, including dozens of elite quality. But what is more striking is the skeleton of the blood baron summoned by Zhang Wen, which shows a level 10 lord creature. What the hell is this? The players all looked sideways, if it wasn't for teammates being able to see the attributes of the summoned objects, I would have regarded these bones as monsters. He summoned more than 800 level 13 bone creatures alone. Are we playing a game? It's too outrageous. I'm so stupid. The skeleton of the blood baron at level 10 is displayed as a lord creature and has three skills. Isn't this the booze in the village dungeon? Everyone immediately reacted. This is the teammate who jumped off the city wall and blocked tens of thousands of monster players by himself. One by one is exaggerating. This is after killing Booze, directly use Boo's corpse as a material, and transform it into my own summoning object. Although Quan Yin was surprised, he calmed down quickly as he had expected it long ago, and said in the communication channel. This is the boss who won the SSS level customs clearance evaluation of the village dungeon. With them, we still can't keep the village. Everyone pay attention to the reasonable matching ability, the victory must belong to us. Zhang Wen's 800 white bone wild boars jumped off the city wall and rushed over desperately, leaving only a dozen or so to protect him. Even if these bone boars are crushed, he can summon corpses on the battlefield at any time. Anyway, the S-level magic power enhancement makes his mana value and magic recovery attribute very high, so there is no shortage of mana. With the assistance of Zhang Wen's Bone Legion, more beasts were successfully trapped 20 meters below the foot of the city wall, which is the range of the remote output player. Especially the corpse of the Blood Baron, Crazy Instant Kill 10 Beasts, the three skills of Blood Sucking, Dark Shackles, and Bat Clones are constantly used. Zhao Yuan obtained the effects of many healing skills, and the healing players in the rear kept throwing skills at him. But he suddenly gained two powerful aura buffs. Healing Aura restores 50 HP per second, and can slowly heal severed limb injuries. Life Aura. Gain 3000 maximum health points. These two Halo skills are definitely S level, otherwise the effect will not be so terrifying. The blood returning Halo can also treat severed limb injuries. You must know that this is a Halo skill. It can cover a wide range of players. The larger the range, the weaker the corresponding effect. Unexpectedly, there are hidden S level talents in No. 401 Novice Village. Zhao Yuan saw a player named Yun Ning in the battlefield standings and ranked 5th directly. He was probably an S-level talent who had turned on the Halo skill, otherwise his points would not have risen so fast. A bunch of 10th-level beasts fell next to Zhao Yuan and were killed by the real damage counter-injury effect. Of course, there were also the skill effects of the rear output player. As the commander, Quan Yin immediately discovered that all the players had two terrifying Halo skills on them. He locked a girl in the crowd. She was surrounded by two mottled lights, and the aura that covered all the players came from her. 7K Wen Gua. These three are all from the same team. Three monsters, no wonder they can get the SSS grade of the dungeon. Quan Yin subconsciously thought that the Halo girl Yun Ning and Zhao Yuan were in the same team. He immediately spoke on the communication channel. There is a powerful Halo player in our team, and the scale of victory has already tilted towards us. How can we lose with three big players? We can't lose. Quan Yin started to speak again to boost morale. Wang Muhe secretly thought that this guy does have a set, and now the morale is not good, everyone imagines that they can fight monsters and attack the village, and finally exchange points for rewards. Although I can also conduct, I really am not inspiring, or I am not good at. I'm going. This aura is so powerful. It restores 50 points of health per second. This effect alone is equivalent to having a level 10 auxiliary player beside each player, who specially adds blood for himself. The players were excited. Not to mention the effect of treating severed limbs, woohoo. Take off. Now I'm not afraid of dying. 
I'm shrouded in a halo, and I want to jump off and confront the monsters. You don't want to die, you will be killed instantly when you are focused on fire, don't say anything about adding blood, do you think you are the one? The melee player pointed to Zhao Yuan, who was blocking tens of thousands of beasts by one person under the city wall. The second halo directly adds 3000 HP caps, and I only have 600 HP in total. What's more, it directly adds 5 times the HP. Tell me how to lose. Pay attention. That big guy named Zhao Yuan failed to block all the beasts, he failed to taunt the monsters on the farthest sides, it's our turn to play. A shield player shouted. Monsters, give me points, this is a disaster, it's just good luck. Zhao Yuan was in the very center of the battlefield, surrounded by countless monsters, and once the taunt returned to cool, he would use it immediately. However, the beasts on the farthest sides were not taunted. These beasts rushed to the foot of the city wall and collided with the meat shields and melee players. Quan Yin pierced the eyeball of a ferocious beast with a sword, and after pushing the corpse off the city wall, he said to his teammates, The three of you are going to protect that yunning. She just activated two halo skills, and she has already rushed to the fifth place in points. This is just the beginning. By the way, bring her a few bottles of potions to restore mana. This level of aura skills must be extremely mana consuming, and she hasn't reached level 10. Both skills are auras, and there is no ability to increase mana. Yes, Captain. The three Mylan players protected Yun Ning, and presented more than 10 bottles of potions to restore mana. Yun Ning didn't talk nonsense, she just kept her magic recovery potion and drank what others gave her. If they were not fighting against the tide of monsters now, the players of the three Mylan organizations would be close to Yun Ning. A user with a powerful halo ability who looks gentle, sweet and youthful, who wouldn't want to curry favor with him. Who wouldn't want to be covered in this aura all the time. Zhao Yuan, who is at the core of the battlefield, has a relaxed expression. After the SSS level anti-armor level is raised to level 30, the passive physical defense and magic defense provided are too terrifying. These level 10 ordinary monsters and elite monsters in front of him couldn't break through his defense at all, and were constantly pierced by real damage from anti-armor, which became Zhao Yuan's experience points, skill proficiency, and battlefield points. The Bone Baron, under Zhang Wen's fine control, only killed those monsters of the meat shield type, because the effect of such creatures was not very good after they were wounded by Zhao Yuan. The SSS level anti-armor is extremely terrifying when facing high attack enemies, and Zhao Yuan can also forcefully taunt continuously. This halo is really easy to use, isn't it? It can be called a killer weapon on the battlefield. Is it possible for this Yun Ning to become a teammate? Like Zhang Wen, a team of two can become a team of three. Zhao Yuan said to himself, Everyone is a cornerstone talent of S level or above, there should be this possibility. Puff puff. A series of iron thorns slammed towards Zhao Yuan. This is a long-range attack monster. The iron thorns on its body could be shot out, but Zhao Yuan felt nothing when it fell on Zhao Yuan. Instead, the spike monster 20 meters away was killed by counter-injury, and died inexplicably, even though it was so far away. Boom, 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 countless spells and arrows fell on Zhao Yuan's side, almost aiming at the top of Zhao Yuan's head. This is also Quan Yin's command, because Zhao Yuan attracts most of the monsters. Under the premise that teammates are immune to damage, aiming at Zhao Yuan's position for bombing is definitely the most efficient. Zhao Yuan even saw bullets pass by him, as this a player with gun skills. There are countless skill categories in the Doomsday game. Players can use thermal weapons, use supernatural powers, summon alien creatures, and use magic. There are even some skills that require players to release them with bare hands and cannot wear weapons. Not just warriors, priests, assassins, mages, archers, berserkers in online games. Everyone can walk out of their own unique path through the combination of skills, but the highest level present is only level 10, so there doesn't seem to be much difference between everyone. Even in the late stage, it is not impossible for players to drive a huge 20-meter high mecha, or become a cultivator, to fight against the catastrophe. It depends on which cornerstone skills each player chooses. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.